Yo, what's good, y'all? No mercy, trap New York mm-hmm. shit, no mercy TV.com. Listen, man. <laughs> today, today might get a little dark. <laughs> Very dark. Very dark. It's looking man. wild out here, man. Um, yo, first off, um, <clears throat> going back to last week, shout out to the uh Mo 3 sector. Oh my lord, man. Feel me? New had, had, had new a, people. <laughs> Joe, had a nice uh convo with uh Sin of you know that's one of the people they're telling us to bring up you know what i mean um we, we ain't know who they was when they pulled up but you know i kind of spoke to us got a better understanding and um you know what i mean yeah y'all yeah. better relax man this, this become the new dark side of a battle rap you know what i mean so the new dark side don't don't mess with us we we got a, we got an you. army over here army. you know what i mean <laughs> <laughs> we, we, look, we we know everybody likes uh to have their cult following and you know stuff like that. Spe- speaking of cults, we 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 gonna talk about that later. But speaking of know, cults, uh, nah, people saying Lux was a uh, you know what I mean? Oh yeah, 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 Idiot. yeah. That was wild. That was wild. That was wild. That was wild. Yeah, yeah. Well, Lux whole... was a sacrifice. Was a, was a, was a, oh man, wait, what? Is... Wait, what? Your man. Oh, bro, we're not even talking about that nonsense, bro. <laughs> I thought you were talking about just Sub Zero. I thought I, I didn't even know. I didn't even oh, see God. that. No, we're not even talking, bro. Don't even bring that up. <laughs> <laughs> don't even waste breath on that, man. Don't even Yo, waste. The second I've seen that, I'm like, oh nah. Yeah, don't even, don't, don't yeah, don't even, don't even waste this. How, how, how? So now, what happens since he's alive? It just automatically erases from history. No more. He's no more sacrificed, or they revived him. Oh my god. Like that's why I'm they, don't even they found the, they found the Dragon Balls. <laughs> Brought them back. Don't to even life. bother talk about that nonsense, man. Um <laughs> what uh actually I'm gonna save that for when X is because you know when X get here. But uh yo, uh since we how do we begin, man? What do we start with, man? <laughs> Where was everybody when they heard the news? <laughs> it's like nine eleven, you'll never forget. <laughs> you'll never forget man that whole thing that whole thing was insane man all right so i'm chilling i'm always late i'm always late to everything right so right. i wake up and i'm looking on twitter and i see a mad people talking about lux like lux is yo this dude's like uh dead and then i saw then i started seeing that was corny sub-zero why'd you do that ah, ah. i'm like what is going on with sub-zero they can't be talking about the old dude from 93 that had when they had the lions then sub-zero i didn't even know right. he did anything right so then i search up the video i search uh loaded lux sub-zero and i see the titles loaded lux is dead i'm like good lord man what is happening so i go and take a look at the video and I'm just like, bro, what? And his only, his only information he had about that whole thing, <laughs> yeah, Dre G. You know, I gotta, I got, I gotta bring it way back, '93. <laughs> <93. laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so I'm like, yo, he, I'm listening to him, right? And he hasn't. I haven't seen Sub Zero since the Pat Poos freestyle. It's <laughs> hilarious. Um, and I'm sitting, I'm like. So his only information that this is true is some other old dude told him it was true. What? So so I'm like, what are you talking about? And he's standing on it. People are saying he's alive. This is not true. Like Head Ice is telling him it's alive. It's not true. He's still right. standing on it. People are trying to tell him, yo, what you're doing is wrong and a lie, right? So that was right. the first night. Then he spins the block back. Right. Well, well, see, th- this is where I happened to catch everything at because I caught everything pretty much as it was happening. First, um, of course, his his stream went up where he's talking about oh, Loader Lux is dead, blah blah blah, and yeah, he was he was said his it was uh, he actually said it was his connects from D.C. that told him that was what he said at first. His people's down in D.C. told him that this happened, right? Um, I also I don't remember that. I heard he said his OG told him. I, I also got um got wind of it because uh the website on Smash, if y'all know them from the blogging days, they used to drop music and you know they was real heavy, you know, in terms of the whole music situation, right? They had posted the blog, so it kind of gave it a little more legs because now you have an actual website posting this man's blog, mm-hmm. and from there it just spread like wildfire. 
So, of course, y'all know how it would go. Throughout the night, everybody's hitting up everybody they possibly can, hitting people like Head Ice, Rex, um, anybody that they know to be close to Lux to try to figure out what's going on. And right, by the time you woke up, niggas had got answers, niggas had spoke to Lux. And it was turned out that it wasn't true. Yeah. You understand? So the people are telling you this. People like Uncasa, people like Rex, people like Ice, like all of these people are telling y'all that they spoke to Lux. Yeah. You understand? I, I don't believe that everybody just makes this up out of nowhere. I think Sarnetta said he spoke to Lux. Like so many people said yeah. that they spoke to Lux. What? Everybody's lying? Everyone was lying to him. He was standing on it. He was standing on it. He said, yo, you got, I mean, he's, yo, Lux got shot in the face. Yo, man, two shots to the dome, man. He's out of here. Like, I'm like, the way he was talking was like. He told like he happy it happened. Yeah, right, right, right. So then the next night he comes back around. Now, at this point, everybody and their mama told him that Lux is alive. He comes back up there again. So what you going to do? Conjure him up? You can't find him. He's dead. Watch the family. I think they going down to get him. And when they produce the body, y'all going to look crazy. Uh, he's now, dead. Now, let, let's not forget. All the people that was, you know, on social media that were making videos were calling him a bozo for basically yeah. spreading false information. Uncasa, Gully TV. Like, it was a bunch of people. You know what I mean? I'm mm. surprised I didn't catch it straight. All the battle rap was definitely getting him out of here. Vada. Yeah. Kenny, uh, I was about to say Kenny Lewis. Uh, Yo, Jay Black. What is wrong with Piper, you, son? <laughs> Piper Boy. <laughs> um, And a couple other random people that I don't know from a hole in the wall. You feel me? So, oh, the Mo Three uh, takeover is happening again. Oh, Salute to y'all, man! <laughs> Shout out to Mo Three, man! Shout out to Mo Three. Um, yeah. So they uh, so so that happened again, right? So they they doubled right. down. He doubled down, right? And now at this yeah. point, it's like, all right, you you got to be doing something for like just clicks at this point, right? You got to yeah. be doing something for click. People done told you he's alive. Like, people yeah. done told you they spoke to him. So at this point, it's no reason to be doubting all these people versus you and your one old person in D.C. that told you what happened. Mm -hmm. Like, it, it should be no reason to doubt everybody else. The Mo Sector came in heavy. Salute. Salute. The Gorilla Gang, man. <laughs> Gorilla Gang. Gorilla Gang. Yeah, yeah so so that happened, happened uh -oh, right? Why like somebody hitting on you in the chat? <laughs> hitting on me? They're talking to you, bro. They're talking <laughs> yeah, <okay>. to you. <laughs> uh yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so they, so that that happened, right? So then the third night, the third night, they show me shows back up. The title is loaded. Lux is alive. <laughs> so in this one, we got some good content out of this one, bro. This one was wild, son. Wild. Yeah. Cause now he's he's like, well, the OG told me. And I believe him. He had no, he never lied to me. And I it's always cause I've been to jail. It's always cause I'm gangster. I, 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 like all that has happened. And uh, a gangster told me he was alive, so I stand on it. We was in the yard together and we was doing 50 push-ups and he was holding the weights when I was lifting them and he was spotting me three reps and such. Right, 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 right. They were doing uh -huh. all that. There we loaded Lux up. Yeah, there we go. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Show love to Lux. They showing up. Sounding, sounding stupid. Very right. stupid. Very, and, then, and then he started going at on. Then he started going yeah. at that Gully TV, which I'm going to be honest, that video was a little wild, right? Of him in the bed and all that. That was that a little was cra crazy. That was um, a little crazy. The, the dude pressing him when he, well, they say he wouldn't get out the car. He did get out the car, but he got out the car, cop of the fleet, that he didn't want to fight. And then, um, what what was those charges that they brought up? What were those Gully TV charges? Because I seen corruption of a minor, and if that was Gully TV charges, then we got a whole. I must have. I messed up. I messed I must have missed that part. Oh, I might no, have I checked the entire life. I know. I checked out after a while. He was saying the same thing over again. And I'm gonna be honest. Him keep calling ten toes down all these when he didn't mean to be calling them. <laughs> right. That was funny, bro. <laughs> That should have me rolling. That should have me rolling. Appreciate the love to the Mo Three sector, man. It was gully right. charges. Oh man. The, oh wow. That is wild. That is wild. That Nasty is wild. work. Nasty that work. Corruption of a minor was on there. I, 
Listen, man. <laughs> that's, that's, that's I, I got it. I ain't see it. I ain't see it. So I, I gotta he, go back. They said uh, ten toes down posted the uh was the one that posted the charges. So we, we gonna look into that. We gonna yeah, look into yeah, that because yeah, yeah, if yeah, that's yeah. the case, then nah, we got a whole different convo to have with Gully TV. Because nah, we ain't doing no no child molester shit over here at all. Like we, yeah, we not, nah, that's we wild. But I, I've never even heard of him, so I ain't. I don't care about nothing. Yes, I don't. I don't, I don't care right. about none of that, bro. But uh, ten toes down. He smoked him for it. Who? Uh, Gully. Oh, okay, okay. I'm gonna take a look at that. I'm gonna take a look at that. But yeah, yeah. so that so he, so he was going in, and then Uncasa got it. He said he was gonna. He says you can't. Uh, when I see you, you can't go to jail because they're gonna rape you. Like he was going in. <laughs> he was but, <laughs> He was going crazy. He was talking about, yo, I'm going to bump into you in Harlem. I'm going to see yeah. you, and I'm going to grab you by your collar, and you can't even mm -hmm. defend yourself. He was like, I'll give you a knife, and you still won't be able to beat me or something like that. Like, it was funny. But he apologized was, yesterday. They're they're cool now. Yeah, I, 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 I was like, come on, Uncasa. You, you no, can't take like did, did you see everything he said? <laughs> did you hear what he was well, saying? About I didn't see Uncasa's first blog, so I don't know what extreme he went to. But I mean, yes, he just, uh, mm -hmm. Sub Zero was a bozo for going at people who are telling him that Lux is alive. Yeah, it was corny. He, he was, it a was bozo corny. For that. And, it, and it, then it, when you actually get to his excuse, the reason that he did what he did, not just the, the whole old jail stuff, but did, did you hear what he said about the father? Uh, who are you talking about? About uh, Lux's father. Oh, that he mixed up the names or whatever? Is that what you're talking about? Yeah. That, oh, the father was so distraught. First of all, if for those of y'all that don't know, right, um, this was actually Loda Lux's brother that passed away. His name is Jay Lux. J-A-Y, not just the letter J. Like, I guess some people were making it out to be like, oh, it's, it's J Lux, so it must be for J for John. No, it's J as in J-A-Y. That's how you spell his name. Lux, L-U-C-K-S. The father had another son that he didn't keep in Harlem. He moved him away to, uh, I think it was yeah. Baltimore, so he could have a better life and not have to go through whatever bullshit they was dealing with in Harlem. Um, <clears throat> the quote-unquote OGs or whatever that Sub-Zero spoke to, even they didn't know about this other child. Yeah, you know, So that's why they thought that um, you know, when, when the father was saying that, yo, my son is gone. or I think he also mentioned the name Poppy. You know, that's yeah, what they call him Lux. Poppy. Yeah. You know what I mean? Lux, they, they call him in the hood. They call him Pop Lux. Like, they, they call him that. So um, I guess that also caused some confusion. But the father was also, like they say, distraught. He was emotional. So I guess that's where the mix-up happened, right? But then, you know, Loaded Lux, he pops up with a video. Yo, I'm alive. He shot out on Casa, et cetera, et cetera. Yeah. So the, the problem is... Sub Zero was so gung ho on um standing on what he was saying that like he still continued to go at people, and I thought that was some bullshit. It was the corny. fact that it's like people are, are are condemning you for having wrong information. This is the internet era. We we're gonna do that. If you have your information wrong, especially you killing off somebody like Lux, you know there is gonna be a problem. You know, you, 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 allegedly your mother dog got knocked on about it. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, so, I heard that. But but, but what he was saying, okay, this is what I don't understand I said, about that. Because I don't know if it actually happened. Because I know, I, and I don't understand what he meant. Okay, this is what I don't understand. He because first he I, he could have been just misspeaking. Because I've heard two <laughs> different ways he was saying it. He says, if I was there, you would I would <laughs> you would have been painted in the hallway. But then he says, if that was my ma house, I would have I would have shot you through the peephole or something like that. Like he kept saying two different, so I didn't know whose house was popping out, who came right. to whose house, but so I ain't know if it was his mom's house, because then he also said, "I'd be there sometimes." So if right. I would have saw, if I was there, and then, so I didn't understand that it could have been so, him so just what misspeaking. He said was that um they been to his mother's house before? Like he said, Lux parents been to his crib while um you know he was like editing footage or whatever like that, so they know where his mother stays at. Yeah, you know, especially in Harlem, it's not really a, a big area. So you know, it's, it's not hard to, you know, know where somebody' family or whatever is at. But um, the person that they said did it was a dude named Twelve. That's a dude that you know run with Lux. I think, if I'm not mistaken, that's the dude that Geechee 
was calling out in the battle, like, yo, you got your rag on the wrong side or something like that. Like, it's <laughs> stupid shit during the battle. But um, I think that was that was the dude that they said went to Sub-Zero Mother House. You yeah. know, so I, I I don't know if it happened. He, he said Gully TV was the one that threw it out there. And I don't know how credible he is. So, you know, but yeah. um, Sub-Zero was awfully mad about, you know, when, when that got brought up. So, you know. Yeah, that, I, he, that, should, I, he should have... He what the honorable thing would have been to do was if you right. wanted to jump out the window because someone old told you it was true. And then when they told you it was wrong or you should have at least said allegedly like off rip, just say allegedly I had her to save you. But no, you want to yeah. say it's definitely I'm it's true. But the honorable thing would have been to do is come back and be like, I'm sorry, I had heard wrong information. Uh, people are telling me it's a lot, and I tried. And if people were already questioning it, you should have went another step to try to make sure and verify it was true, instead of right. just people. I don't care about y'all New Yorkers thinking that someone could just tell you something and it's it's just real. The city whoa, 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 is brainwashed. Y'all are dumb, bro. Y'all just down. believe. No, no, no. I'm not slowing it down because this is what the problem is. Y'all think because you grew up in the hood that everything that everyone says is true. That's the problem with y'all. You people you know, from Harlem, especially, just you know. believe everything that people have said to you. That's the, this I was, is I was the issue. Behind the screen, watch that's not true. This, keep this, going, this, No, no, that's yeah, what I'm yeah, saying. Because Excel walks in on a Harlem slant. But that's what I'm, this is the problem. Because y'all are like, oh, you grew up in Harlem. Oh, you old. Okay, you must be true. Man, he never lied to me. People lie every day, bro. Back. Every day they lie. So, who did you think? Because them. he's old in your hood, that means that it's true. Oh, he sold me brick before. What? That that's credible? What are we talking about? That, that that's well, his credentials? Oh, he gave me a brick. <laughs> what? The only bail I shoot him is that the info nah, did come from the father. I'm 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 with the New York Slam. <laughs> that's the only thing I'll give him. <laughs> hey, all right, so what are we talking about? What was Sub Zero. Sub Zero. Sub Zero's a clown. <laughs> <laughs> right to it. <laughs> he's a clown. I'm gonna tell you why he's a clown. Salute, salute, he said salute. Loaded Lux was dead. Uh, right? Gwitty, he from Buffalo. Gwitty. Who? Gwitty. Gwitty, you not even... Never mind, I ain't even gonna talk about it. Like, <laughs> Chill, don't, a, don't do my son Gwitty like borrow, that. Nigga. You from Long Island. Um, so when he said... I mean, well, I'm gonna be from the same place if that's the case. What? Nothing. Um... Oh, Goody's <laughs> upset. Goody's oh. upset. Not Goody who said that my uh, my dog Excel was gonna get thirty by snake and got smoked. Not yeah, Goody's anyway. upset with me. Oh, oh no! Nah. How am I, I supposed swear, to survive? Swear, put it, put that like Goody's it. upset. Yeah, he's upset. Nah, he's I'm rocking Long Island. I'm gonna make a lot. Facebook post. Y'all upstate niggas though. Y'all different. All right. Um, check it out. Here's why Sub Zero is a clown. Um, I was there. Yeah, I don't like Yo, first of <laughs> I was all, there look, with look, you. look, 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 here's what we got to do. Here's what we got to do. We got to stop being proud that where we from is the ghetto and crime ridden and full of fucking poverty. It's everywhere, bro. It's that. everywhere. You tell me I'm right. almost 40. When you tell me, yo, my city like that, I don't want to go there. <laughs> bring me to the nice part. Now, I don't want to the go trenches. nowhere. I go to the project. Listen, I don't want to. I'm done going places where it's like that. I when don't I go to Chicago, go to... I want to go to Old Block where Six Nine was at. No, you no, don't. You don't. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't. I've been so, there. No, that's you the problem. Y'all think it's just sweet. No, I don't no, understand. You don't. No, you don't. It's I've not sweet. There. It's cool. What's wrong with being from the trench in the trenches? I've, I've been there. Being being from the, you know what the goal of the trenches is? To, to get, get out. out. <laughs> and when you get out, do not go back. Facts. Do Jay. Do Jay Z? Do you see Jay Z just randomly walking through Marcy? No, you don't. Drake was there. Drake <laughs> is from Toronto, and he was in Marcy Project shooting the music video with security and police there. He wasn't yeah, he just walking by himself, nigga. <laughs> what are we talking right. about, niggas? Got it. We got to start that being from the trenches and all that shit is from grown. You no, you uh -oh. can't join the live. No, we not. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. no. Being, Why y'all want to let Woody up? Man? No, because what's he, the point? He, this ain't angry fan. This ain't angry <laughs> no, fan. damn. <laughs> Listen, what I'm saying. <laughs> Being from the trenches is cool, nigga. Nobody they got it. Two out of three. I can't. Uh, yeah, argue. nobody in the trenches wants to be from the trenches. That's a fact. 
Definitely. Nigga, I was born in Franklin Hill. I'm from Franklin Hill Projects in Boston. I didn't ask to be there, nigga. I didn't ask to smell piss in the elevator every time I went home. Right? Franklin Franklin Hill is not is, is like that? It's super like that. Got you. I'm not familiar. Super, so. One way yeah. in, one way out. It's not like that anymore because they knocked it down. Right. The projects I'm from, one way in, one way out. Nigga, you know. Yeah, Cavs definitely regular. did show us some love yesterday. He did. Oh, he, he did? did? Yeah, That's what's up, man. Shout out. Now, angry, fan, angry fan, no bullshit. Angry fan, stay showing us. No love. one's talking yeah. bad about angry fans. Yeah, you don't listen. get it twisted. Nah, y'all niggas said this not angry fan. I'm whoa, not, whoa, yeah, whoa, yeah. whoa, 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 whoa. I, I ain't saying nothing. That cause that's, I only said <laughs> that because that's what he, that's You what just he threw at. me in there. I ain't saying nothing. All I'm saying is this. <laughs> all I'm saying is this, nigga. Nobody from the trenches, if you want to be in the trenches, then good luck to you, nigga. But a lot of the niggas that's active in the trenches, nigga, yeah, nobody wants to be nobody no bitch ass no hood. But I know niggas from rail hoods that are bitches. So yeah. the hood you're yeah, from right. don't dictate the type of nigga you is. The people who are from soft parts of town don't care about this shit. So nigga, the that's the and then once you figure out how big the world is, you realize the shit that's going on in your hood is so small. Yeah, like, like, like. Yes, Gwitty, it's, it's a podcast. We talk for two hours. Wait, you clicks. just said, I never, when did I say you? Joining. I said that. Oh, I must, I'm sorry. Yeah, I was reading, anyway, uh, so I must nobody, have missed it. I'm like, when listen, did I say listen, that he came from? This, I didn't even know where you from. Not, this part of Long Island is like that, though. We wasn't gonna talk about Gwitty. We're not going to center the nigga. We're not centering nobody. Yeah, what yeah, I'm yeah. saying is this. Shout out Dan. What happened the to Substance Sub-Zero abuse? nigga is a clown, right? Uh-oh. Yeah. Here's why he's a clown. Nigga said Loaded Lux was dead. Somebody then corrected this nigga and said Loaded Lux is alive. He said, no, he isn't. You'll see. I'll have the last laugh. <laughs> Yo, yeah, yeah. Why, yeah. Is this, why is this something you want to have the last laugh over? Why is a man's life something you want to have the last laugh about? I understand that y'all did some battle rap dealings and it didn't go the way you wanted it to go. Nigga, if you feel that that passionate about whether Lux is l- l- living or dead, you go put the work in, nigga. Yeah. Right. You understand what I'm saying? If I'm that passionate to where I'm going to write on Instagram, I'll have the last laugh on some motherfucking, well, we talking about a man's life, I'm going to go fucking put the work. That means I have a problem with this nigga. And if I have a problem with this nigga to that level, I'm going to go hurt him myself. Yeah. Right. Right. You understand what I'm saying? So that's not a sociopath. Sociopath is a nigga that don't care. Right. Sociopath is, I don't give a fuck. Because if he was a sociopath, what he would have did was, as soon as Lux went live, he would have took all them videos down. He's on, gang, he's on Facebook. That's why you can't see him. He's, you're typing yeah, on you YouTube. He's typing on, on Facebook. Facebook. You know what I'm saying? That's clown shit. Like, niggas is clown. Niggas is reaching for clicks and clout and and, and doing all type of goofy shit. And now, since we talking about the trenches, ain't no and more it, trenches because all the street niggas is on the internet. And and look, it's funny that Tell you say that, Eddie, because w- when when you said the, um, the, the likes and all that other shit, the nigga actually said, yo, what was I supposed to do? Get on the phone with Gully TV and talk to him about it, and then he be the first to break the story? Yeah. So now, this is about views at this point. Like you just openly said that. Like, and first of all, on, man. Before I niggas say would anything. rather be look. They'll rather be the first with inaquerate information than oh, be last. Oh, mercy! You know what you're talking about. Mercy, no, so yeah, you, you mercy, mercy, you, mercy, you, you, mercy, mercy. You shout out mercy, to Matt Hoffa. Yeah, I was <laughs> speaking of <laughs> Matt Hoffa. Got at you too. I, I, I got the clip. He ain't say your name, but he was talking about you. Keep, oh, yeah. You, I, I, I you were the that. peanut gallery. That's what you was talking about. Was you. Um, I did see that. Before I say anything, I should have said anything. I've seen that. Well, I should have said, <laughs> shout bad. out to, shout <laughs> out to, shout out to Loaded Lux. He straight shot at me on some subliminal shit. I was like, oh, yeah. okay. Shout that was you. Loaded Lux and peace to his family because I did, um, if my information is correct here, that there was his little brother that got hit. Yeah, it was his yeah. little brother. 
So shout out to Lux and peace to his family, whatever the fuck he's going through. I know Sub Zero said the people he spoke to didn't know that uh Lux father had another child, but Lux father said he moved him away to get him away from the bullshit. who gives That's a why. fuck. How about you confirm if, Lo- yeah, if right. Lux is dead or not? Hold on, right back. Yeah, you understand what I'm saying? Like that's yeah. my thing. Like, come, like when we playing with that type of shit, confirm what you, nigga. Is it loaded? Right. Is it? Are you sure? Who gives a fuck? But now, granted, Lux father. He was even him. saying the news had it wrong because when I watched um Vada Fly, he had did a, a a blog right after it happened, and he had the actual news article that said J Lux J A Y spelled out his name, so we knew. Is that, Loaded that Lux's wasn't... name is fucking Jay? His name is John. John. So John and Jay are two different fucking names. Uh, uh, yeah. Is anybody in Battle Rap retarded? No. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. My bad. No, I, I get John it. I get what you're saying. Thing? Yeah, total and difference. Jay is two different names. Yeah, nah. They just want the story, man. They don't care about Jay the name. Period, Lux, and then it was ambiguous. But J-A-Y is a name. Yeah. Yeah. So, no, that's just a letter that they added two so extra letters to. I know parents that do that all the time. My, my, I know parents that do that all the time. They Their name might start with a J, and they name all their kids the names that start with J. So he could right. be John, and that could be J. Then he probably have another son named Jerry. Who the fuck knows? Who gives see, a fuck? See, when it I comes to us, right, this is the type of things that happen baby, with us. Something phone. gets... Something, <laughs> something gets thrown out there, right? <laughs> And we discuss it in private in the group chat right, right. and like flush right. it out on my, like, yo, could this be true? You look, he's looking into it. We might argue yeah. about it and it right. happens that it is true. And then that person that if it ends up not being true, we'll get it. But none of it just bubbles to the public. Right. These people just here want to, oh, Lux is dead, shot in the face. Cool. I'm running to the internet. Gangster, the most gangster people well, I've been hearing about. It won't go These to people... the public unless I decide to turn my camera on before. Yeah. And about. then you ruin <laughs> every <laughs> chance. We, yeah. Then you ruin it. And it, like, Dude, like this man, the, the most here? gangster person, oh, I did 90 years in the prison. You were the first one to run to the internet, gangster. What happened? All Nigga, that you shooting did and killing. Ninety and... years in prison. <laughs> you should know, because I'm gonna keep it in stack. He said, "Don't to nobody, <laughs> don't nobody check and confirm paperwork like prison niggas." Facts. Pixie. Prison niggas know your whole docket before Pixie you walk, walk in the motherfucking cell. Before you walk in the the tier, they know exactly who you are before you walk on the unit and what you here for and what you right. Did. My thing is this, like. We playing with somebody life, nigga. Yeah. That this yeah. ain't like a loaded Lux got beat up or he got punched on or whatever. Like we saying this nigga is dead. He had to go live and go, I'm alive. That was crazy, son. He he's really he's in mourning, bro. Now now think about his mind. He's going his little brother just got hit up. Right. He's dealing with that. But he got he got to rush to the internet because of he got to rush to the internet because stupid niggas are saying he's dead. Mm-hmm. On top of it being his son, he we don't know how close he is with his little brother. Or nothing. So let's just say they have a close relationship. What we doing with Sub Zero? The same thing we was doing with him before, paying him no attention. Yeah, <laughs> you're right. There's no point. Uh, that he that that talking. I mean, the niggas that's close to Lux are gonna handle it however they handle it. And obviously, yeah, they knocked on his mother door. <laughs> obviously, niggas that's close to Lux. They did what they felt was necessary, knocking on mom's door, going to look for him, whatever the fuck. I can't listen. One thing for certain, I can't tell niggas how to react. Can't to how to react when you play right. with their family, their homeboys. I can't tell niggas what to do. Yeah, I I, like honestly, I don't have an opinion on that because there's some people who say it was overboard, but then was it the way he was talking? Yeah, like, and then on top of that, you feel it, me? Like, like my thing was this: once you say. I could I could even say being wrong about Lux dying, I can even excuse that, right? But once right. you say shit like I'll have the last laugh, that makes it different. Yeah. Now you it's like praying on him to be dead. Now it's like nigga, what you mean? You understand yeah. what I'm saying? Like you damn near hoping it happened. Like now you are you hoping son? Yeah, that's how I took it. Like you hoping son's dead. 
Like when you do, you hear like, how I he have... was talking. If some God forbid something happened to X or well, not really Mercy. I kind of laugh. But no, I'm just kidding. Oh, if, God. if God forbid <laughs> something, happened... <laughs> he said, he said, no, I'm laughing. <laughs> you know, no, God forbid something happened to Mercy right. or X. I'm not gonna be here live. Do Yo, man, my dog got shot in the face. Man, took two to the dome. Man, he's out of here. Gone. Oh, he's gone. He's in a casket, six feet. And then you throw in a little, man, we were good people, man. I mean, I, I, we did the Lions Den. He robbed me, but we did the Lions Den. <laughs> like, what? wait, wait a minute. <laughs> You're happy he died. Let's just be honest. Because then right. you came back around, and then you said, it, I Kenny look better than him. Kenny I look Lewis. way better than Kenny. him. Kenny, it's not time. It's not. Yo, Kenny. God damn it. <laughs> it's not oh time for that, Kenny. Kenny. <laughs> Kenny. You got to relax, Ken. You have to Kenny. Stop. Sometimes you gotta chill that out. Is wild. Kenny has never <laughs> has chill. That is crazy, man. Elijah Thornberry's out here. Elijah Thornberry. Elijah Thornberry. Wow, <laughs> Thornberry's in a building. You heard? Nah. Um. But yeah. No, nah, I did awesome. sound like he was happy because then he started going at him. He was like, "Well, how how am I gonna be jealous of him when Gully was saying you just jealous of him? I gave yeah. him money. He ain't having. I I set up the lines. Then he tried to rob me." All of this shouldn't come out after you were just wrong about yeah, the man's death. Thing is that, and yeah. Here's, here's right. another thing. Stop helping niggas if you're going to talk about the help you gave them later. Facts. In life. Yeah. Stop. I hate when people do that. I helped him. Who gives, so he right. must be indebted to you for life Forever. now. <laughs> he, he can't say you nothing. Help, I, if you, 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 you was mad and dead because you didn't pay, can you? Pay you back or something like that? Like you helped, he helped you I, twenty help. years ago. Get over it. Yeah. yeah, mind you, it's like if I help somebody, right? If I like, let's say I help Mercy or I help somebody, whatever the case is, right? Boom. I'm helping Mercy because I believe in whatever the fuck he got going on. Facts. Mm -hmm. So uh, if it don't work or it don't, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna be like, nigga, I helped you twenty years. That'll be like <laughs> Mercy. Let's say something. I, I stopped bad. Not in talking about your death, like really. Yeah, let's say that we talk like, about stupid. I, me and Mercy fall out. Some shit happened. Go, yo, Mercy, like yo, I got XL battles. Like nigga, yeah, <laughs> right. You believed in what the fuck I had going on at the moment, so you right put it together, nigga. Like that's he's a, like, like no, nobody, nobody talking crazy could ever make me compromise my morals and then start talking down upon a man and I think that he's dead. Like it's it, it made no sense for him to go into all that. Yeah, why didn't you say all that? Shit, like like it, it was unnecessary. Right. Why didn't you say all this when he was alive, out and about? It's clear that you have the channels to get yourself heard. You got a whole channel where you're imitating <laughs> Star from Star and Buckwild. That's Your a shit fact. is a whole copy of Star <laughs> shit. Yeah, I do. I'm gonna be honest. I felt a little. I felt a way. Cause that green screen with the chat in the background was kind of lit. I ain't going front. I yeah. kind of like that. And I'm like, I was think, I was looking. at I'm like, I could have been doing that in the beginning when I had the green screen. I'm like, I could have been doing that the whole time. I didn't even think of that. Like, yeah, like you still could that, do it. I, yeah, I guess. But it's the storm. He's caught. It's, it reminded me of watching that. Reminded me of the star in Buckwild. Yeah. 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 Star. Yeah. Star. Star He's star. advertising his girl stuff. Like he had a whole promo run in the middle of this. Fake death scandal he's having wishing, like it was yeah, all we're not wishing crazy. Death on people, peace to loaded luck. So I hope that you know that you know everything works out how it's supposed to work out. Mm -hmm. you know what I'm right. saying the ducks don't crash out, which I don't think you will. You 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 uh seem like an intelligent nigga. You got your wits. And about I mean, you. clearly, it's people willing to do it behind him. So <laughs> no, no, no. I'm saying I'm saying for his brother. Fuck the sub zero. Yeah. Dude. Wow. Oh come on! There's <laughs> clearly, people him. willing to do it behind him. Crazy. Oh, my no, willing to. No, he ain't even gotta ask him. About, <laughs> don't accuse Loaded Lux of that. Yo, that was disgusting. Like, we can't put that slander on Loaded Lux's name. Like, yeah, <laughs> so I'm gonna that say was it. Filthy, I'm gonna say yeah. it in other ways because whatever the fuck he's talking about, <laughs> some other shit. Listen, condolences to Lux. Don't yeah. crash out over your brother. Yeah, yeah I'd leave too. Over your brother, yeah, I get the fuck out of it. Yeah, Over that was your filthy. brother, you know what I'm saying? I know that that shit is a. I don't know how close you was with your little bro. I'm sure y'all had a, y'all had some type of relationship. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Don't crash out, my nigga. You, you, 
Well, however the culture feels about you and when you battle, that don't make nigga, niggas love you, nigga. I'm gonna just keep it real. The culture, you're one of the legends and goats that we have in this motherfucker. You're probably one of the only goats that carried himself like a goat. <laughs> yeah, we did, right, Jay? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, I was filthy. Yeah, but yeah, rest in the stack, Lux. You're, Lux is probably one of the only goats that legends that carry himself like a legend. Right. Like right. he never is involved in no stupid shit. He's no never no drama, no, no bullshit. Candles. Yeah. He he only pops out when he wants to battle. Mm -hmm. He ain't fucking you don't see. Like I I don't know. Maybe I haven't I've I've never seen Lux really do anything out out of pocket. Uh no. I mean, if you want to bring up the the thing he was bringing up, the lines then thing, but that was all yeah, in the I beginning, bro. I mean, like you know how we see Mook with the he be yeah. looking drunk and shit, bugging, and he be fucking. What I know? told Mercy on the oh, phone, man. right? I, he was like telling me how everyone was calling everyone, and I'm like, wait, you you spoke to such and such, and you didn't ask about Mook. What? I don't care about. <laughs> we know Lux is alive. You should have got the scoop on Mook. I want to know if he's yeah. locked up still. Oh, what? Where God. he's at? Mook. Yeah, yeah, Mook. <laughs> call him to the ground. Yeah, he spoke to I the. I wasn't thinking about Mook. He I'm spoke to Lux. Lux is. We know he's alive. We. I was. I'm like, yo, you spoke to the man that's right, his right hand man, and didn't ask about why. Oh, you talked to Rex. I didn't want to. See. <laughs> he spoke. To Yo, that's fucked up. He you spoke to Rex and, and asked about Mook, no. Like, yo, what happened to your man's? What it just it looked Where like he just he beat his kid and left. <laughs> damn Mook. He, he's already in the gulag somewhere. He's gonna get himself out of there eventually. He's in the gulag. That's fucked up. <laughs> what? No. That's crazy. Yo, what what about this, I wasn't talking about, no about discarding people life. He just yeah. discarded Mook life. He's in the gulag. Fuck him. It looked crazy because it like optically it looks it like yo like he just abused situation. his kid and got arrested, bro. Yeah, that 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 situation. But again, I wasn't thinking about that mook shit when the luxury was going on, honestly. Like, but you already know he was know, alive I was though. For, I I looked at Head Ice Twitter. Once I seen Head Ice Twitter and he was like, when I, was No, when, when, was by like, the time Rex Yeah, yeah, matter of fact, yeah, when he when about the time Rex hit me, yeah. Because they know you can man, I don't even care about that. What happened yeah. to Mook, yeah, man? I went right there. No, but, I, but the thing was, I had hit up everybody like Lux is alive. Time. I was like, oh, all right, be good. <laughs> I'm going. Anybody right. would know if anything happened to Lux, it would be Ice. And Ice was trying to tell him, yo, stop doing this. He's alive. Yeah. <laughs> Produce him then. I, I was just with the nigga. Calm. Yeah. Relax. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I, I was talking to uh, I, sp I spoke to Lux. I mean, not Lux. I spoke to Ice. Spoke to Rex, and I spoke to Daylight. So if you t and, um, Daylight, yeah, he said that too to me. I'm like, why? I said the same thing. I'm like, Daylight. Why are you talking to Daylight? Connection. What are we talking about here? <laughs> because again, knowing that uh, Daylight been in contact with Lux uh, camp, you know, I well, figured a battle that's to never gonna happen. <laughs> it's gonna happen sometime. That's like Dr. So, so, Dre on, Detox. That ain't hold never on, coming out. Hold on, hold on. I just some street shit goes down with a Harlem nigga. You, you call a nigga from what? <laughs> huh? How do that make sense? Yeah, <laughs> Grape Street, man. You call the nigga from Grape Street. Call daylight if some shit goes down with Geechee Gotti or something. Yo, Jay, you need to stop, nigga. I know you over there. What's cracking? I know you know what's going on. Daylight Dot Mark. Huh. He's from what? <laughs> California. The so opposite what? side of the country. Yeah, he went he so total left, bro. You went way too shit. far. He don't know what's going on. Ice, Rex, perfectly good. Yeah. Wave, <laughs> Ike. You could have called mad Harlem niggas. That's true. Wave, Ike, true. mad niggas that just would have known what the fuck was going on. 2098, right. Yeah, man. And yeah, ain't never why going down. Why you that? Why he no show pass, B? Because I, I didn't care about that. You talking about Lux? Care about his pass battle? Don't now you. Now I you don't care about Head Ice word. battle regardless. I just want to. Nah, it's not. No, no, no it's I don't not like passwords. How you said pass like passages. No, no pass is pass is dope. Like I'm talking about. I don't care about a Head no, Ice battle. I'm not mad That's what I'm talking about. How you feel about Head Ice? Don't say pass like he's just. I didn't care about battle. their battle. There you go. I don't care about there you the go. Pass battle, nigga. What pass? But you care about a head eyes battle. 
The lemons are really what slippery. What the heck are we talking about? <laughs> Slipping on lemon, shoot your teeth. Mm, mean. No, oh, okay. Yeah, I got you. That was dope, man. Killed the game with that one. Yeah, <laughs> Listen, yeah I get it. You don't understand the lingo. It's all good. Yeah, yeah, right, right. Uh, oh, hey. Words, word, word, Philly. Word. <laughs> they like would say Lux is alive in Antarctica. <laughs> this nigga's a troll. Hey, XL, you watch uh, Gully TV? No, I don't watch none of these niggas. Yeah, I didn't know anything about him until you mentioned it. Nah, we, 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 because we, we stumbled across some, uh, some egregious charges. He had corruption of a minor. So who? who? Gully. <laughs> Gully TV. <laughs> Yo, stop. He told me I didn't, I didn't see it. All these niggas with these internet channels is weird. <laughs> yeah, they really are, though. They're all weird. Something with really kids, are. man. They love these kids, messing with these kids, man. And I just watched the Nickelodeon. Nickelodeon. Oh, don't piss me off, man. Man, oh man, man. Oh, my kids, don't piss me off right now. That documentary is the sickest shit in the world. Yeah, that, that was cool. filthy. That was filthy. Dan Snyder, you need, like, you, somebody just needs to knock on Dan Snyder's door and just punch him in his face for the rest of eternity. Because <laughs> you are a wild nigga, dog. Yeah, that was wild. That was wild. You had wild. the kids in there sucking toes. You had the kids in there fucking squeezing potatoes, trying to get the juice out. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> Yo, I had no idea Ariana Grande, that's where she came from. Yeah. yeah. My kids watch the show still to this day, and now I'm quite second guessing it. I don't know if I want to watch it. That nigga is the fake come. The funniest part was MC Fetus. I couldn't. I'm gonna lie. I'm, oh, you never. You know, I remember. I've all never that. seen that before. I did. I, was, I remember all. I just didn't know I what a fetus crying. was when I was a kid, bro. Bro, I was crying. Like they made that little black boy do. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I remember that. Mad funny. I remember I didn't the, mean the laugh. As soon as he fucking they showed him, I was like, "What?" They had what? the black dude with the big nose and all oh, that, bro. My. God. And then, and then, you know what? It should have been a red flag about Brian Peck. Let me tell you something. You know what it should have been when he brought you to your house and said he had a signed autograph picture from John Wayne Gacy. You should have been like, "Wait a minute, you work at Nick? He's like, he's proud showing it off. Hey, look at Gacy. Oh, the guy that killed and raped thirty kids and buried them in his house. I gotta go. I gotta. Go. I gotta sign. What? You can't work here no more, buddy. Yeah. You and then you, and then fuck. after he did his thing to Drake Bell, he goes and works with other kids at Disney. Exactly. He's like, oh, I'm gonna, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go tear up Disney now. <laughs> you <laughs> gotta get, you are, you, like, you are pen pals with who? Oh, yeah. nah. You pen pals you with John Wayne Gacy, here, buddy. What? You They're like, go. oh, that's cool. We <laughs> brought more. Pe- hey, take a look, John Wayne Gacy. What the fuck was that? Was crazy. and you're gonna tell me Disney ain't never heard of Brian Peck. That was crazy. Before, after he got arrested, you're gonna come on, come on. That was a lot. How did you just become up, ninety times louder? Out of up fucking, um, he was filling up Leonardo DiCaprio. It was just wicked. Was just that whole thing was wicked. Fun. Yeah, it was. Ri- that was a weird, weird. I, yeah, Adrian, Ariana Grande, like, oh, I'm thirsty. Pouring water on it. What the fuck is going on? She said. I'm so wet. I'm like an ocean. Oh, and then the, uh, the Taint character, Taint. I remember oh, her. Penelope Taint. Penelope Taint. I remember Penelope Taint. That's then the crazy. and then the oh, hot hands. <laughs> hot hands. Yes, yo. Shit like that. 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 YouTube person we have. You know what his race is, high hands. You know what it is. High hands. High hands. You know, high hands is high hands. hands. You know, yeah, you know. yeah. <laughs> Why are you loud? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only, what are you talking about? I think you're picking. You're going through your computer now, bro. What you, you are like, my- You are infinitely louder now. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, hold on. bro. Penelope Tank. Yo, I used to watch. I'm telling you, I grew up on all that. Literally, yeah. like I grew up on Amanda all them Mara, shows, bro. Her up. Amanda. Oh yeah, yeah. She went down bad. Do I sound better? No. Hey, to me. Oh, you, you damn. Don't. No, <laughs> you sound way different. Just I don't know. Maybe it just got loud. You hit like a vibe. I don't know. You just sound yeah, infinitely man. loud. Um, Amanda Bond, they fucked her up too. Bad, bad. Yeah, she so had, that she had super talent. Like I didn't know she was doing stand up at seven years old. I didn't know that either. Yeah, That's crazy. And she's she, she's one of those you could see that she's a star from the gate. Like she's got yeah. the personality and everything. But yeah, their relationship was yeah. 
That was yeah, she's a, she's wild now. Like she she's. Um, I, I want to see what she thinks about this whole uh documentary. She won't talk. She's twisted, bro. She won't talk. I just seen a thing where they they saw her because I guess she's going to be like she got like a nail salon or something she runs. So I guess right. they ran down on on like TikTok or something and asked her if she wants to talk about it. She's like, I'm not talking. Nope. Yo, they are packing oh, wow. up Josh Peck, bro. They are packing him up. The yeah, Drake dude. had to tell them like, "Yo, relax," because they oh. are not relent. They're relentless because he was one of them that was always defending Dan Schneider. He was always right. defending. He was always out there, like oh, so. They, Drake and and Josh? They, yeah, 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 yeah. I Josh, Pepp. look at them because they look the same. He <laughs> and he and then so he does a podcast, right? Because this is what no, I did said, after I watched said SpongeBob it. SpongeBob when he said "Dirty Dan," that's what he's talking about, Dan Schneider. That's crazy. That's funny. <laughs> that's funny. That's wild. I, I no said I, I I went and saw I want I like because I knew Josh had a podcast, so I went to his podcast to see if he was ever if he mentioned anything. They did a podcast like two days, so it had to have been when that thing dropped, or unless right. they filmed it a couple. I don't know, but they were all in the comments frying them, frying them like you 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 yeah. you because that Drake thing was that was sick, bro. Yeah, that was like, they like, had like it. when he when he said, "Uh, think of the worst possible thing that you would consider sexual assault." I was like, "What?" The? Like that, and it all happened. Me. It wasn't even cat. He showed the they showed the paperwork. Showed Everything the paperwork. they yeah. said. Now there was one thing I will say: that girl, that Salala girl, that, that was like speaking. Yeah, me too. Me too. I felt he knew, that. He knew from the rip, like, nah, nigga. And, and when he like, said, oh, I'm glad it didn't happen to you, I'm like, oh, I knew oh, that tear yeah, him that up. That was, man. I knew that was about to tear him up. Yeah, that was oh. wild. Um, I, I will say that, that Salala that. girl yeah, or whatever. I, huh? Yeah, I wanted the shootout to happen. If I was Drake's dad, oh, yeah. I would have AK for everybody. And then that oh, rando girl. dude that just w- took you a kid out into the parking lot and raped him. I'm like, what? I'm shooting like the janitor or something. <laughs> like, remember what they said to the father about? Oh, he was uncomfortable. Um, because he was gay. How, yeah, they talked because he was uncomfortable with Brian Peck being so close to his son. Because he's and gay. He told the studio. The studio was like, "Oh, that's just your homophobia." Yeah. <laughs> Nigga, I'm clipping. Let me tell you. Something. Yo, that's the Everyone major died. gaslight. <laughs> Yeah, oh no, nah, I'm laying God. it down. <laughs> I'm laying it down. I'm, I'm gonna use Slide's method. I'm laying everybody down. Everybody. The old Nickelodeon. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Remember uh, John yeah. Q? Remember that movie, John Q? Of course. It would have been like that, but in Nickelodeon. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm There's not holding you hostage. I'm laying y'all down. <laughs> There's a crazy nigga in with a gun holding everybody hostage. When Dan and Schneider, and then all the people that were supporting uh Brian Peck. Oh court, man. Sean oh, from Boy Meets World. Yeah. Oh, I saw him. He was speaking about it too. Uh, he did a podcast. I guess they have Pod Meets World or something. I think yeah. I think that sometimes when they ask people to write character letters, they don't. I don't think the people know what's going on. Bro, he says that. Bro, one of them letters. That's some decent bail to shoot them, but I don't know. <laughs> nah, I know because I, I'm not saying that they don't know. I'm just saying I know some. I know. Well, like, they knew the something. Process, sometimes character letters you they won't tell you. You just write. Nah, but look, some of the letters no. was like, "Oh, he was under extreme pressure." Yeah, I know that was pretty, like, he, Yes, he crazy. said he must have been Dick, tempted Daddy, to do that, man. bro. What? Yes, he said he must have been. They must. Yeah, yeah. The, I, 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 the but child. I what they're oh, saying, like the crazy. child must have been hammering or pressuring him to do that for him to step up outside his mind to do that. What? And some the of these letters came from females too. Thirteen year old. Thirteen year old. Can't get me to do nothing. 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 Yeah. I hold, if you ain't see it, go to Max. Go to hey, Discovery. No. Go, yeah. I don't want to do nothing. Go watch it. It's disgusting. I'm telling you. Yeah. It's the. It's filthy. It's filthy. It's filthy. Um. It is. Uh. It's what else hard. had happened that I wanted to talk about? Um. That loser. And Snyder, he did an interview responding to it. By the way, too. I saw it. I watched it. it, it it's easy to. No, hey, hey, Sly. Never trust a nigga with no neck. No, <laughs> you know what I didn't like, and I saw when I watched that interview, that man that was interviewing him, that black dude that was from, yeah. he worked with them by the way. That was like Jay Black, bro. Yes, yeah. He, it was, it was, it was like when Black interviewed Beasley. That's what I saw. He's not letting him. He's not pushing him on any pushback on nothing. He's just asking him a question. Oh, the writing room, not cool. Okay, well, talk about how he made that girl. First of all. Sit there and and do the, the sodomy joke 
Well, act like you're getting sodomized while reading the line. Why didn't you ask about that? You didn't ask about none of that. Um, Talk about what y'all did to Josh Peck. Or uh, not Josh Peck. Sorry. The Drake didn't even barely scrape the surface with that. Didn't say nothing. But, I mean, they mentioned it a little bit. He got his cry. But anything to counter it. Why he's like, right. well, what you had them girls doing wasn't cool. Why didn't you say, why did you have them massaging you in the first place? Nothing. He just skipped right over it. It was the most softball questions I've ever seen. Dan got to go. Daniel. You gotta yeah, go. pack him up. Pack him up. No, we, we good on. We don't need no more kid shows from you. None of that. Like, like I don't even want to see no more kid shows, period, now. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, yeah. oh, I don't know how Nick's going to still operate. I mean, I don't trust it. I'm not I'm shaky. Everything's shaky there. It's it's wild. They uh, said what, Nickelodeon never. Re no, they said Nickelodeon responded for comedy. They had it at the end of the episode. Oh, they always ensure that it's a safe work environment or whatever stupid shit. They, yeah, uh, spent, like. I was conflicted too, trap. I'm going to be honest because yeah, it's like packing Drake what, up for being. No, 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 no. But no, they kid said something about he was messaging underage. Yeah, I'm going to tell bro. you, Mercy, if you stop talking over, I'm going to tell you, man. Oh, you get you. Get to it. I'm <laughs> well, I'm trying and you cut in to tell, start back at the beginning. All right. But you arguing with me. You're okay, not here we go. Point. Here we, Here we go. Okay, so Drake got in trouble and got probation for text messages he was sending to an underage kid. Now, I was conflicted watching it too because it's like he did this. We know he did that, but look at what was happening to him. I think we have to separate that part of this and just focus on the fact that no kid deserves what he went through and no That's kid right. needs to go through that. To go through that, excuse me, yeah, but yeah. that's it. Yeah. What, wait, what? He lingered. Or what are you talking about? Yeah, I don't know. That's some new shit. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, I'm. I'm not gonna say that he's right for what he did. That don't excuse the fact that what he went through was foul. Yeah, yeah, right. Um, like we, how like, how do y'all feel about people saying? Oh, because he went through what he went through, he was traumatized, and that that's might have led to that's a fact. That's how it happens. Misdemeanor charges of disseminating matter harmful to juveniles related to inappropriate text messages he sent to a teenage girl. Yeah, Sheesh. yeah, yeah. That's, two years that's of probation, the child hours. endangerment and misdemeanor charges of disseminating. Yeah, matter but he said he digitally. I know, but digitally, like through the text messages that's yeah, what i'm saying text like these are like sex messages is what i'm yeah, saying he said he was sexting a girl digitally like, <laughs> should have he Dude. was sexting somebody but that's yeah. that's wow. how it happens bro yeah yeah I yeah mean, like digitally people say a lot of the people that are sexual predators were preyed upon even r that's kelly uh, people yeah. say r, Ke r kelly if you really watch the documentary and you watch his life story he was sexually abused for mad years of his life right and that when it happens like that, and then people think it becomes, regardless of the <laughs> I'll fact, I'll search bro, it. I'm going to search it, because I've never heard digital, yeah, whether digitally. Whether he's her or not, that don't mean he deserved to get raped as a kid. No. No, no, no. The Battle Rap Trap is not saying that. Yeah. No, he's not saying that. saying that. No, 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 no. I brought it up. I said, yeah. I think we should separate yeah. it, because no kid. Back, he didn't okay? say that. He did yeah, 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 yeah. But you can also say that if he didn't go through that, he probably wouldn't if have did that. Digitally penetrates another person without their person's consent. That would be. I mean, he's right. That is digitally, but I. So, I yeah, um, because fingers are called digits. So yeah. That is funny. I'm not. I'm not gonna really agree with that. I mean, if, if that's what people do, then cool. I don't do it. But you know what? Yeah, digitally my thing, penetrate? My thing is no, so no, <laughs> no, I'm oh kidding. I'm. God. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, that's not weird behavior. I mean, if it's too grown. Listen, two consenting adults can do whatever the fuck they want. If they want to fucking dress right. up like fucking rabbits, and, you know what I mean? They can do whatever the fuck they want. They're consenting. The whole point is right. consenting. They give it consent. And if somebody, yeah. They're okay with what is happening. You know what I'm saying? So I think that he, Drake is a fuck, you know what I mean? Most, of, but back to what um, Sly was getting at, it's true. Most of the people that are sexual predators and do vile shit, had vile shit done to them when they were right. young. And, and the thing that happens when you're young, that's when your brain is most impressionable. Facts. Keep that's true. Back, nigga. That's why we like the art. 
That's why whenever you hear somebody say today's today's music ain't like yesterday's music, it's because that music made an impression on you because your brain was most impressionable when you heard it. Right. You know what I'm saying? So when things happen to you when you're young, that's just what it is. You feel me? Like, yeah, so I don't yeah. give an excuse. I just separate it. Like, Drake, you did some weird shit to you, a little weird nigga. But right. Nigga, what happened to you was fucked up too, nigga. That's what, yeah. same thing with R. Yeah. Kelly. Nigga, you, R. Kelly, you, you, what happened to you was fucked up when you was a child, but you grew up to be a, you didn't stop yourself. You didn't, you didn't, nigga, you, you gave out the pain. I don't feel sorry for nobody. Me saying I can logically see how one thing led to the next thing is not me feeling sorry for anybody. It's just logic. It's like people who grew up in violent neighborhoods or you grew up violent. Nigga, you have a, if you grew up in a violent house, you are more prone to be violent. Right. If you grew up in the round addicts, you are more prone to be an addict. I can yeah. if you grew up if somebody grew up in an alcoholic house, I can see where their mama drank, their daddy drank, their grandfather drank, everybody around. But them you drank. gotta be smart enough to know that that's wrong. It doesn't yeah, excuse right. the behavior, is what I I'm saying. No that, kid deserves no kid deserves that to happen to him. But if that right. happens to you, you need to stop and not yeah, do it to somebody yeah. else. Hurt people I'm shouldn't hurt people. I'm and see, too. a lot of times we we give we we tend to when people make bad decisions based on the trauma they faced in their past, a lot of times we'll give them a pass just based off of like, oh, they went through this, and it's like, no, everybody that goes through that don't handle yeah. it the same way. So it's like, yo, some of us are gonna make the better decision to not engage yeah. in some bullshit. And I think we know a lot of wrong. times when people also, too, on the other side of that, when somebody can say, yo, oh, I can see how X, Y, Z, I can see how this led to that, right? Sometimes mm -hmm. people take it like you're shooting them bail. Right. Nah, I don't feel bad for you, but I can see, like I said, if you grew up in a house full of addicts and you become an addict, nigga, I can, it makes logical sense. Yeah. Like right. If you grew up in a violent house where you seen trigger warning where you seen your daddy smack your mama and you that's how you grew up nigga you think that at some point in your mind like understanding you, is not condoning like yeah, i think I understand. Um, that don't mean that like drake bell you's a weirdo nigga and i hope that that if that i hope you got something happen but you going through <laughs> the fucking fuck <laughs> fuckery <laughs> that you went through as a child yeah that was disgusting fucked up that shit is fucked that, that was shit wild. is crazy, nigga. That shit, you know what I'm saying? And the fact that you had to go through it for years, like yeah, years and years of that shit, and and then show up to work and act like nothing was happening. Yeah, and then he also said there was at you know at one point he did get into substance abuse, alcohol cool. abuse, like of course, sheesh. bro. Every you know what I'm saying a lot of everybody don't get fucked up for the sake of getting fucked up. Some people are getting fucked up to suppressed whatever the fuck is going on in their yeah mind. to escape because a lot of people like a lot of people some some people the worst place you can be is to sit alone with your thoughts mm -hmm. right so a lot of motherfuckers don't want to sit alone with their thoughts so they got to get high they got to smoke some weed drink get fucked up that you we all know niggas that get fucked up every day you know niggas that get fucked up every day you think they're doing that because they like to be fucked up every day nope Nah, nigga, they're trying to escape some reality that's in their mind. That's that that they can't something something's going on that they can't deal with that they're trying to escape. Right. But at yeah, the end of the day, yo, ha, the one take it from me, having to deal with the the stresses of life and be sober most of the time. <laughs> listen, man, it ain't it ain't uh it ain't easy. And I'm not knocking <laughs> nobody that gets fucked up or do what they do. I, and I'm not yeah. saying that everybody that gets fucked up is trying to escape some type of reality because there is times where getting fucked up is perfectly acceptable. You know what I'm saying? But at the same at the same time, I think that you know when it comes to people like that, like nigga that, like Amanda Bynes and them, like dog, you just got to be careful. Right. If you have your kids in that type of business, you got to be careful. You got to be, and then you also got to let them. Where be was kids. Nick Cannon throughout all of this? Huh? I said, where was Nick Cannon throughout all of this? Because he was a he was a he, child he came star. up with Nickelodeon. Um, but he I might think have been his, later. He was, uh, yeah, he was, and he was older. Hmm. Nick was older. 
It's just like even even if go throw it back to Michael Jackson, nigga. Michael Jackson wasn't normal because he didn't have a normal childhood. Right. That nigga said That's he didn't true. dribble a ball till he was seventeen years old, which is crazy. Dribble a ball, nigga. I, I will say that Nick Cannon, that's one person that I am waiting to hear um what he thinks about the whole situation. He's going to probably say the politically correct thing because that's Nick fucking Cannon. We think he's going to be like, Nick, I'll shoot this whole shit up. No. You Nick, think, was, Nick was also The person older. that was just under fire for anti-Semitic uh, stuff. You think nah, Nick be- was older. Nick had, fam- Nick, has connect- Nick had connections to the industry. He came in 17, 18, 19 years old. Trap, this, this is what I'm saying. Like, the fact that he was completely absent from the whole thing, it made me feel I don't like think he was... was a, hold on. I think oh, he I showed up at, afterwards. Like yeah, he was way after. Dog, he came... When he... He came in at 18, 19 years old. He's damn near a grown man. Nick Cannon ain't young... Hold on, I'm looking it up right now. When did he? Yeah, because um, oh, he was on all that, um, '94 to 2005. I didn't even know that. Yeah, how old? Yeah, he was a regular on um Nickelodeon. I didn't. I I forgot he was a part. I thought he came like all after that. How old is he? He was born in the '80s, so whatever that makes. I thought I didn't even remember him from all that. So he's born in the '80s. So he's probably. I know he was a part of all that, but I thought he was the old, the after yeah, he them. Was born in 1980, so he that's was crazy. When he came on the scene. Hey, I totally blacked yeah, out Nick that part. A yeah, gangster. that's why nobody fucked with Nick. Nick, Nick joined Kenan's all father. that, and Keenan and Kel cast. Brizzy, yeah. you right. Brizzy, you right. Nick Cannon's father is a well-known gangster. His family is well-known gangsters. That's why nobody fucked with him. Yeah, bro, I only remember him from Keenan and Cal because they barely mentioned that, too. They mentioned it, but they didn't talk to, like, Keenan or nothing like that either, or Cal. Keenan and then I remember up. that. Keenan's Keenan fucking up his Saturday Night Live bag? <laughs> <laughs> and then the, <laughs> and then the Nick Cannon like, show or whatever it was called, right? I think that- Keenan said, nope. Nah, but they also said Keenan's mom was always on set and shit like that, too, so they come fuck. Nick Cannon. Oh, yeah. Yeah, if your mom's always on set, then yeah, you're going to be good. But Kel went through a little mental shit, too. Yeah. Kel was off a little bit. See, they don't even mention all that in... I'm on yeah, Nick they didn't, Wikipedia. Yeah, they didn't show yeah, nothing about Nick it. Nick Cannon need that bread, nigga. He got his business right, yo. He called them quick. You better not show not a... You better not show a still of me in this doc. Yeah. <laughs> don't even show me... Them. Flag the video. <laughs> nigga, yeah. Nick, you know. Ooh. And I'm sure he probably is like, yeah, get that Dan nigga out of here, Dan Schneider. Yeah, he, he wasn't. Yeah, he that wasn't was wild. Now. Um, So what else had <laughs> yeah, happened? Keenan ain't fucking that Saturday Night Live bag up. No comment. Oh, no, nah, hell no. What, 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 what else happened you know, I want to talk right about? on this show. I ain't oh, never. man. What was um, it? She, uh. They no. they told easy he can't throw no more events in Philly. Okay, I don't care about that. Uh, I'm not. <laughs> I don't care about that. No, more it was. I wanted to, to talk the, about more power what? to the Philly people. Y'all niggas fight amongst yourselves. Yeah, y'all I don't care about figure that. that out. How y'all figure that out? <laughs> How you gonna stop a dude from throwing an event? I don't want to hear none of that. You can't. Oh, let's talk about Mercy. Yeah, yeah. That. Thank you, Kenny Lewis. Let's talk about Mercy on that oh, little man. um on his little podcast he went on. The views oh, yeah. from the top of the hill the or whatever. It wasn't the podcast. Okay, the interview. Sorry. Because this is, he lives for this because he want, loves to talk about himself. So this is what you gave oh, him a platform Maggie to say. Good. Oh, shit. Everything he wanted to say about it. And the first thing they put out is how you wanted to burn down, uh, what's it called? What's that league? I battle. You said you were going to burn it all down. Now tell me. What? Hold on. Wait, what? That's what he said. He said the title was even, I was about to burn down the whole thing. So he was, you he was ready. win. All when over we, him saying, going at it. when you and Lex was trading, trading mean dishes back and forth on the internet, he was ready to shit. tear the, the whole thing down. Going at it, mm-hmm. yeah. When they you were put go- the picture of him in blackface, he, he was in blackface. We not know he that. wasn't, oh, he was in a charcoal it. mask. Shut up. <laughs> so, what he was trying to encourage people to exfoliate their skin. If you know Lex Luthor, if you know, you know Lex, Lex Luthor, you know what that picture was for. What was it for? What was it for, Mercy? Please tell me. I don't know. Please tell me what the Puerto Rican nigga was in blackface. Well, tell me. 
it, you 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 don't think Lex was trying to be funny? Or wait, he was, no, he's poor, bro, wait, he's, whoa, whoa, he's Puerto Rican. You think you're trying? Hold on, Lex is always trying to be funny. You think you're trying to be racist? That's what you think he was doing? Yes. But he's Puerto Rican. I believe he'll poke yes, a racist dog. joke. He's, a, he's been calling him whole, white the whole time. I didn't Lex know. The whole Latin king. I keep trying to oh, tell him. Oh my this. god! He referred to himself as a white boy, though. I showed the screen. Everybody, Lex he was is calling a nigga himself that if a white make, boy. Lex is Syrian and Puerto Rican. He's a Latin king. Lex is also a nigga. If you make fun of him, he's going to lean into the joke. Nigga, are you, you said he was white, so I thought he was white and black face, bro. He said he was white. You he's be thinking everyone's racist, man. <laughs> Yo, he made references talking about, oh, white boys, it's our turn and stuff like that. This is from him. He was saying... Dog, mercy. You do this thing where, where if you dislike somebody, you take everything they say as literal. He said, yo, if he says he's white, I'm telling what am you, I I'm going to, say? to tell you this right now. As somebody who is really Lex Luthor's homie, who knows him, who be it, slept in his house and all that, Lex is Syrian and Puerto Rican. Lex Luthor is a whole Latin king for real. I've watched real live Latin king gangster niggas come in this nigga's house and all types. I know he's Latin king. I, I've heard. So how, is he, how can he be a white boy? Wait, whoa, well, so king? you knew and you were still calling him white? Again, oh, because he man. said he was white. Lex I is hate. A troll, I, see, y'all. I thought you were be. I'm trying to believe you for once in my life. I'm trying to believe what you're saying oh, is fact, and you're still lying. Like, oh <laughs> my god, he's like, dog. He's so. All right, Sly. Lex is a troll. Uh, he said it, not me. Lex, he said is, it. Lex is a troll, right? He's a troll. He's Lex is like daylight level troll, nigga. Right. So he was trolling with that, but he wasn't trolling with blackface. Get out of here, nigga. He he did a charcoal mat. He wasn't trolling then, though. He was clearly trolling because he, niggas he, he knows what that looks feminine. like, but he wasn't trolling. He was being so he was being racist. Yeah, yeah, he was I being believe, racist. I, I believe, nigga from listen, Team I Mommy. I'm not gonna hold say, on, okay. hold on, hold on, hold on. Because when you say somebody putting on blackface, the, the 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 offense there is them being racist. The nigga that's from Team Homie with PH and Pumpkinhead. Wait, he's telling of Team Homie team, too. He, he's in. Team oh Homie. my God! Team what Homie, mercy? Nigga, what are you doing? Hold on. The minute you do some racist. Niggas would knock on your door. The same niggas that told money back, he got to relax with saying nigga and all type of other shit. Lex is doing blackface oh, with niggas to show up to his event and talk and knock knock him out. That that come on, my nigga. Or is he had or does he have a charcoal mask on? Because in that live, he yo, Selly. All right, I'm let me pull this. the picture up and I'm I'm gonna ask the chat. That's what yo, we're gonna do. Yo, 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 you ever yo, had a yo mask Mercy, on your you face? can't put you can't put hold on. A mic pause no, in front of Mercy name, ever again. Kidding. Don't give him another show by himself. Yeah, he just goes off a, on a tangent. About, Lex is a Lex is a troll. He's a cornball. He's not a racist person. Did you watch the whole live, or you just seen that clip? Because in the live, he clearly says, "I'm about to do this live with a charcoal mask on." Watch what live? The one that you took the fucking screenshot of him being racist. Uh, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't take no screenshot. Everybody's posted that shit and seen it. Remember, it but went did viral. You watch the time. live? Did you watch? Him? I didn't know. Did, I didn't watch the okay, live. Okay, so when the you picture. watch the live, he says, "I'm about to do this live with a charcoal mask on." Fuck you, niggas that got anything to say about it. My girlfriend put it on my face. I did not see no live. I never seen no. That's live. where it I comes from. The picture. Facebook live. Remember when Lex had that spree where he was going on Facebook live, yelling at niggas, telling everybody he sucks. The nigga said, I'm doing this live with this mask on my face. Fuck y'all. My girl put it on me. I never seen that. Ex- but you, but here's I don't know. Maybe works. X knows. I don't know I'm either. I just saw happened. the picture. No, I'm just I'm telling you what happened. Picture. He said, I'm from doing Mercy. this live with this charcoal mask on. Fuck y'all niggas. My girlfriend put the mask on my face. But then niggas take the screenshot and go, Lex Luthor's doing blackface. <laughs> well, I have no idea about that. <laughs> If you're gonna diss niggas, diss niggas factually. That's my whole shit. Use facts. He's never once said fuck you niggas. He don't say the in I never heard him say it. He don't say nigga. Lex don't even talk like that. I be around this nigga. Wait, oh, so he didn't say that either? No. <sighs> this is the picture. I mean, it's, it's so small. Mask, Can you zoom it's in and do it? It's not even good blackface because he still got the white pieces of his face showing. All the women in here, the women, women, 
Is this blackface or is this a mask? Please. <laughs> it looked like Lex Luthor trying to be funny. <laughs> I mean, I, yeah, I was about to say, let me let me let me say something. This is a bad look, first of all. Regardless okay. of what his intent was, that you shouldn't have it. This you know what people are gonna run with. This this was op, like I let's just it, speak but when optics. You say, hey. I'm doing this because my girlfriend put this on my face. I'm going to do the live anyway. Fuck you, niggas. I, yeah, I, I'm only going off of what I saw was just the picture and Mercy's framework of being racist and blackface. <laughs> then he went, oh that's, that's, that, that, <laughs> look at Travis. Yeah, no, that's well, a yeah, joke. <laughs> yeah, without, without context, it looks crazy. Okay, I can yeah, agree it, with that. Without and my context. context was coming from my dog over here that was telling me, yo, he's racist, he's in blackface. He he tripled down on it even on the show. He was yeah, saying it. I think it was bugged out. I and think he, he I mean, and then he yeah, asked the pill. It's a fucking pill. I have one of those in my crib. Uh, mercy. Okay. So no, I never. He, I because ne he's calling him white the whole time. White, I didn't know he was white. a Latino. I, I didn't know he was part of that. Team Hami. I didn't know he was. <laughs> Mercy's looking. Oh boy, well, I, 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 I didn't. White in Spanish. I didn't. But you emphasize the white part when it comes to that yeah, mask. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, yeah. you want to call him racist. Yo, There's mad on. times I've said, "Yo, Lex is a Latin king. Lex is a Latin so, king." I, I never knew. Mad so. Time. He you says so. <laughs> and you say so. You can't so even be make them all Latin. He's not you white. You can't be white and be a Latin king. That's like being a white crip or white blood. You can't be that. There was a white crip. His name was Milk. This, you're not supposed to be because of the <laughs> black gang. And then he got out. <laughs> Everyone, all the black crips got one down about? and he left. <laughs> you can't be you can't be a white Latin king. Listen, I, I, I have I, no idea about gang rules. I'm not in the gang. I've never been a So if I tell you, yo, somebody is a like gang now, gang, if I tell I you, bang bang. now that's like me saying as a black man, yo, I'm part of the Aryan nation. <laughs> yo, here you go. <laughs> yo, mercy, man. You are a sick dude, man. This nigga <laughs> is in Team Homie. Yeah. Why now, do you that, need to stop? You're not allowed to call nobody that, racist is, no more. You're done. You <laughs> here's the thing about that. Saying somebody's in team high. Listen, homie. we were at internet war. <laughs> you was gonna, you gotta right, pull out on. Here's the <laughs> thing about saying the niggas in team homie. Like, I know when niggas say, yo, team homie is really one of the only crews that hold the crew members accountable. Facts. So, if Lex was to ever do some racist shit, you know what happened? It's possible they didn't know about that. Well, XL's you know in it, he you knows know, about Spray it. Seven, right? Spray Seven sees and knows everything that all of us do. We all have a joke in Team Homie. If you if Swave, if you see Swave's number on your phone, you have to sit and think for a minute. <laughs> well, yeah, Damn, what did I, I do, do some fucked up shit this, in the last couple months that Swave is calling me? Mercy, when you be on your smoke search, because that's what this is. Nah, it wasn't a search. Oh. It was right there. You take every damn you it. take Dwayne posted it for God's sakes. Like, damn. Take, oh, see, now you click the friend of the enemy of my enemy is my friend. That's the type <laughs> yeah, of that's nigga not my friend at all. That's not my friend at all. Let's take oh, nigga. so you got your information from DNA too. <laughs> he got his information uh, so DNA now he's credible. Too. So when you go to war, he's credible. But now any other time he's a liar. Oh, uh, yo, I'm, <laughs> I yo, I'm done, bro. I'm, 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 a, I'm done with you, bro. He is a liar 99% of the time. Unless he posts some shit about somebody Mercy don't like. Now he's like, yo, man, he's got the facts always. Yo, 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 <laughs> facts. yo he posted it. If he posted it, then why can't we? I'm he. No, Mer nah. He came back the other day. Told uh, he Stop. told the world he told Stop. the world that uh, Mercy he was watching a bootleg from Mercy. Stop. Mercy was running Stop. the stream. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know Stop. where he made that up from. <laughs> yeah, that's why that he, nigga he just said lie. That, that nigga like, said what? DNA Tooth is a liar a hundred percent of the time, <laughs> except for if he posts some shit. That's like when the girls go, "All men are liars," but he told me I'm so funny, like <laughs> shorty. <laughs> please, please, men please. lie all the time, and he told you you was funny. He's <laughs> what you what the fuck you think was happening? That and was why I made that post with the picture. <laughs> they was getting him out of there. 
Of course, they. It's the internet. And look, I didn't put no caption on a picture or nothing. I just posted it as a profile it's picture. The internet, and it was niggas, crazy. niggas, like dog. We this. We live in the narrative they was going world. Crazy like, under we live that in picture, a, actually, I ain't gonna hold we, you. Of course, who? But who? Who are the? Who are the quality of humans that was going crazy in the picture? That that, that was all battle rap, um, people. Again, what quality? What is the level of intelligence <laughs> that was going crazy? See, that's how I judge it. Niggas like, yo, I got a million views. Who is the million watching though? A million dumb niggas? That's, a, that's a one view. That still means something, though. A million. No, views. it don't, because you can take a piece of a million brains and make one smart brain. There's nobody <laughs> valid watching this shit. Get the fuck out of this shit. Niggas is stupid. <laughs> we live in a world now where we don't give a fuck if it's 100,000 wrong niggas. As long as it's 100,000. Right. You got 100,000 people laughing at you like, nigga, I got views. They look, they're laughing at but you. But when I did the podcast, I believe I said I don't think he's racist. Everyone I know you only BC. framed he was racist while you were warned. He said that? Hold on. What did well, BC listen, he, he did a battle that? with a guy and said uh, two cents a day could feed his whole family. Question. I thought that was, you know, question. I'm question. sorry, he did a what? He battle he rapped a... somebody and made and made fun of, and made fun of them. Oh no! Oh, you mean like <laughs> Cadillac said, Ron and everyone loved him when he did that whole "You're so said, black he... and you're this." And... He battled somebody and because they so, were skinny. Black looking dude, he said for two cents a day, I could feed your whole family. Whoa, <laughs> in a battle. I say I didn't know that battle. either. Oh, yeah, he slander. called him a starving Ethiopian or something like that. Like, oh, yeah, he called him starving. Mexi- <laughs> what niggas have about? Mexican? How many niggas called so Tay Rock's a racist? He did a whole second round calling Cortez a dirty Mexican. He called him, a, he said, oh. spick and span. So racism him, is bro. okay in a rap battle, huh? Racism is okay in a rap battle. Oh, so, oh, so let's cancel like? rock then. All right, so let's lead the charge. We're going to cancel rock for being racist. Cool. That's fine. That's fine. If racism is okay with rap battles then. Oh, we so Pat Pastey was doing that. Disaster does it. Disaster dressed up like a fucking, ch- like a child in that- monk. Hold on. Dumbfounded. Pause. Disaster. <laughs> the only thing that disaster crossed the line when he did the sand niggas. <laughs> that was wild. That was wild. That, that was, was wild. He he, was he, he exceeded he, the line. He <laughs> Why did you run it back? Ran yeah, it back. yeah, yeah. He ran it. They already said don't. He passed don't the line with that. that one. Yeah, he he. he, he and then he, and then look. He dressed up as Hitler. Hitler. <laughs> to a Jew <laughs> as person. He battled Iron Solomon, right? <laughs> a Jew, a person of Jewish descent. It's Hitler. Like, you know what I'm going to do? You know how I'm going to kill him? I'm going to dress up as Hitler and rap in German for 12 bars. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> who's hating on Chris? Who, who's like, Chris? I don't know who you are, Jay Smith. Yes, I, I am know. a hater. Now, no, hold on. This is how you this is how you kill that. Yes, I am a hater. Hate I hate Chris all of this shit. I don't know. Man, but yo, no, let's, let's, I want to pick some <laughs> Chris Hansen. Can you get back to where you don't look like that anymore, please? Yeah, like what the fuck? Is what? You know Do what you not like, care Sly? about presentation Sly, you know ever? Like, like now nah, you know what I forgot like, to charge my light. That's what it was. So Sly, now you know, you're gonna do this in the dark. I look like one of them um documentaries where they got the, the yeah, yeah. You look like you like molested somebody, <laughs> and you don't want to show <laughs> yo, your face. Yo, I can't, I, yo. What the fuck, man, man? I was drunk. I didn't Make mean one to. Of them lights white. <laughs> like you ain't right. unlocked. Yet. Use, like, use unlocked your phone. Character. Use your. <laughs> he is a habitual line bias. stepper. I don't, That's I don't a fact. Y'all niggas ride for a nigga you don't know. Um. Anyway, so let me actually talk about someone up, that said something that Mercy. I actually got him witness protection. Right. He I want. I want to say this, <laughs> and I know we always give we 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 get at Mercy for this, but I'm actually gonna I'm a I'm a, I'm a credit him because when it came to this clown, I'm about to mention listen, listen. clown. I'm about Sly, to mention. Sly, I love when they d- call us haters for of other people. Do you see how we do Mercy? Yeah, we fine. But I, I, I want to say this because that loser that snuck caps the other day went up on Black Compass, right? Because his M Rec debut was just trash, and he's still showing up to M Rec. It's trash, right? He shows up to Black Compass and and decides to call everybody in battle rap coons. Oh, 
We're yeah, all coons. Thanks. I'm a hater. Thanks. Thanks We're all coons. Cool. My new since 1986. Oh, because boy, we Thanks. spoke on something he decided to drive 97 miles away for because he was mad a little, uh, 36 months mad about one yep. situation he caused because we spoke on it. We are the goons yeah, for doing speaking it. Speaking of that situation, Avocado has the best tweet about that situation I've ever seen. What do you he say? Said, what do you say? I've been filming battle rap for 12 years, but Uncle Ra filming cats walking in the rain looking for Debo is the most cinematic thing ever. In it, that's what I said. I said I it looked crying. like a movie. I, I, I was bro, crying. The like, angle of it, like the rain oh, coming. No, yo, it was like a movie, bro. <laughs> it was. Uncle Ra. Uncle Ra. Yo, Sly, you got to give Uncle Ra's credit. He did that. I don't know it, what camera he used. But you did I he I have, he even had like the angle he had and I don't even know what he was doing but he yeah, just filmed what you were doing. that was like Christopher Nolan like, like that was like yeah. <laughs> it was incredible Oscar that was Christopher Nolan level work right there. yeah, yeah bro he really got him a black magic you see we out here inspiring yeah. the people man. all right shut up so yeah so Debo <laughs> Debo calls us all co magic. yeah he doesn't the magic. thing can't be alive for more than two yeah, seconds. <laughs> Debo calls us all coons for speaking about it. He goes up to definition. He goes. Of no, it's not. He goes to black. He goes to black compass. Right. And they're questioning him about it. Oh, I don't want to talk about it. You know, it happened. And, you know, I, I'm going to let them all do their coon behavior, the content coonery. And and instead of, you know, I know Mercy likes to defend him and say he didn't run away. He stayed in the parking lot because he's tough when he didn't. But so when that, I know he likes to defend him. He actually checked him behind the scenes about that. And he, and I got to give him credit for it. I got to give Mercy credit for it. Oh, uh, you talking about that? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah he checked. No. Check, go ahead. Listen, what I'm doing on this show, <laughs> trust me, what I showed you in that text message is just a fraction of conversations we have about, you know, different shit. Like, I'm not one of them people <laughs> that I'm like, I I'm afraid to text people. Job. Like, if I, if, if, if something happens, I give people the real about it. I have no problem doing that, especially with <laughs> oh, him. Like, shit. Ooh, come on. Yo, listen. Come on. Yeah, Debo, I, I'm going to tell you I don't you like think he liked um, Harlem Legend coming up here, though. I'll say that. Why? Uh, what did he say? <laughs> what? No, say it, say it, say it, what say what he said. Nothing. I just said he didn't. I don't think he liked all them. Let you Why? Go what made you no think one. that? No, because hold on, X. What made you think he said why he didn't like it? Say it. No, nah, be, be, because of some some of the stuff he was saying on the um on the Black Compass interview about um what what he, what he said uh uh people in in battle rap is, is supposed to be for you and, and something something he said. I, I was like, I felt like it was a little bit of a shot. So, oh, okay. oh, okay. oh, 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 so oh, because so. you're his friend, you can't let nobody tell their side of the story. I got yeah, you. I got you. Cool, right, cool, 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 Debo, cool. I'm gonna tell you like this, my nigga. Um, anybody knows me, you know, I'm not a coon, nigga. I'm, I'm and we I'm never planned the Harlem legend thing, we were talking yeah. about the situation. He he was we, watching we really had, I'm not even, I would, I didn't even bring it up. It was in the chat. It literally happened live. What are you talking? You don't have to bring right. that up. Yeah, yeah. No one. I don't care if Debo thought we brought it up. Debo's. If we're gonna talk about if, if us speaking about something's a coon, then what is stealing? What is a, if none of this has anything to do with a coon? By the way, That's selling out your own people. But I'm just yeah, using his. Why, how does it make us a coon for speaking about it? But you rob Yo. the girls in the culture. You give. You 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 you've done every shady thing. You celebrated people bootlegging events. If they ever did that to you, you would cry yeah, real on. tears. Let me stop real quick. Like yeah. stop. Do me a favor, bro. If you're gonna watch the show, watch the show. I don't give a fuck what you think about. Oh, I. So I'm I, I'm saying like like he has done terrible things in this culture why am i why do we care about what debo said the only last time we spoke about debo like in any when was the last time we spoke about him anyway like like positively oh debo really did this good and we got to celebrate him when was the last time that happened because all he's been doing is jumping from platform to platform trying to gain relevancy he gets packed out everywhere he goes that's why he had to go to MRAC. he couldn't go nowhere else he had to wait to go to black compass and they did it to him too he goes everywhere and gets disrespected everywhere why yeah, do we yeah, care at some 
It's, it has it happened every time. He if he was he would never come up here. He would never go anywhere because it would be pressure on him. And every time he does, you know what he does? He goes right back to, oh, I'm a tough guy. I'm going to fight you. I'm going to fight you. I'm going to fight. It's so corny. And yeah, then he waited 10,000 months to hit caps, slap him, and run away. Like, you, th there's nothing cool yeah. about what you do, bro. You my sold out your this, whole right? company you said you to a man and push you. he put you on stage. He yeah. gave you every... And then, and then what's funny is when it comes to Caps, right? You went to Caps and cried real tears. I'm never going to forget that. You cried real tears on the phone with another man because you again ruined another event because of your nonsense that you do and cried. Well, he didn't ruin that event. And we cried. Ah, it's his fault. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, no, now, look, I know it's a fight, look, but it's his fault. fault. He should have done here's, better here's, to stop here's it. Here's my thing. Here's my thing. Here's my thing. <laughs> Niggas is coons, right? You even said you're on the outs with Sway because of this event, because of what you did, right? Yeah, he, he, he shouldn't have put that out there. Like, why do we need to know that? But uh, but here's the thing. Swave has a reputation of being one of the most solid niggas in this shit. Fact. Right? If you on the outs with him, then guess what, nigga? You did some sucker shit and it didn't go how you thought it was gonna go, nigga. Fact. You tried to sneak a nigga when he wasn't looking. Let's just be 100. Let's just be 100. You tried to sneak a nigga whether he had one arm, whether he had two arms, whether he had whatever the fuck, right? Right. This man comes to a show and says, stop talking on the show that you are a part of. This is how yeah. stupid he is. It's how dumb yeah. this man is. <laughs> right. Stop talking. <laughs> Trying to a sneak podcast. a nigga <laughs> that wasn't looking, right? Tried to sneak him, right? Regardless of your respect level, whatever the case may be, right? Then you left. You didn't complete the mission. All I said was, if you was going to put your hands on a nigga, finish the job. Right? right? Facts. You wanted battle rap run up on blogger points. That's what the fuck you wanted. But everybody's looking at it like, bro, you bugged out. Because of the way you handled it, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, right. Even he when, like he caught a body, look, even he's when Twerk ran up on look, we, we retired. Even when Twerk and, ran like, up on Norb, Twerk gave Norb the less fight. Right, right. I, I, I yeah, I think uh, yeah, I think or no, no, no. I don't think he gave Norb the less. I fight. think I he, he just he beat him down. Him, he let him know. He put him down. Is what I'm saying. Right, nigga. You know why I'm here. You know what's up. Nigga, it's go time, right? My thing is this, yo. If everybody's saying you're wrong, you're not right, my nigga. This is what it is, dog. Right. A hundred niggas call you a crackhead, nigga. Guess what, my nigga? You <clears throat> smoke some crack, my nigga. Probably. <laughs> Probably. If you did some sucker shit, and then everybody's... And here's the thing about it. Nobody even said you was wrong for hitting them niggas. Because, again, right. I can't tell nobody how to react to disrespect. Facts. Yeah. My thing is, how? why didn't you finish? Yeah. That's all? Yeah, because he said he went... First, he said he was waiting for him, but then he also said that he wanted to knock him out and embarrass him. So which one was it? If, if you wanted, wanted to you... knock... So you failed both missions. <laughs> Damn. And then you're mad at us for somebody saying, yo, you failed both missions. And that's why you don't do shit on camera. Because when you do shit on camera, niggas can have an opinion yeah. on what you did. It, it, you left it open to the public. And you, you know, you, you can't yo, do something like that. I you know what that, interview you I was watching? For, somebody for said years. something. Slick. You know what comes with that. Somebody said something that was real as fuck. <clears throat> It said people do outrageous shit and then get mad when there's outrage. <laughs> That's a fact. <laughs> That's funny. That's like funny. That. That's fun. It's a fact, though. It's a yeah. fact. You look crazy doing something, then you're mad you at us for talking crazy about it. Shit, and then when niggas call you, you do some crazy shit. We call you crazy for doing the shit. Now you're mad. Niggas is yeah. cool. Yeah. You was on camera. <laughs> you was on camera doing what you did. And then, again, laid low like you caught a body or something, and it wasn't even that and serious of a situation. Up, and now you're on a, a podcast run? Yeah. 
Yeah. Give this nigga yeah. his fade. Yeah. yeah. He, he set the stage for everything that was said about him. So, like, I don't have any sympathy for, you know, I'm going to now give this all with I'm battle rap is this, shit that, that third is toxic. I don't care about that. Now, battle rap is toxic. Yo, I, yo. Yeah, I got some of it. Here's why, here's, why, here's why I love, <laughs> here's why I respect Aver. You know why I respect Aver? Because when the game turns on him, he never bitches. Yeah, he, he embraces it. I give him that. He embraces it, nigga. He You're never bitches. Right. I, I he don't be like, oh, you niggas is toxic and I'm leaving. And nope, he just get right toxic right the fuck back. Right. Like, nigga, he was wishing pregnancies on people during the fucking, <laughs> during, the, <laughs> during the volume. You seen what he said? You seen what I said in the group chat? He's like, hey, Nunu, I'm going to send da 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 <laughs> Yeah. Verb, that that's funny. why I respect Verb. Because if you've been in battle rap for a long time and you've been here long enough, you know at some point the game's going to turn on you. Just mm-hmm. what it is. It's Wait, I say he gets points for what? I said he gets huh? points for the pull-up. Yeah, and we argued that, and yeah, I think he might have turned too. that around because you don't get po- you don't get points for driving a hundred miles and then running away. You don't get points that for that. Nigga went to the basketball game, shot two jump shots, missed both of them, and left. Adept gets points for the pull up for pulling up and staying there until you came outside. That's what you get yeah, points yeah. for. Yeah. Oh, allegedly, yeah. oh, we weren't yeah, there. Yeah. On, X, on, remember, on, we weren't Jay. there, hold so on. we don't know if I'm you did anything before you leave. Just I don't know. Here we go. Your man Chris Unbiased is a weird old freak nigga with freckles. Don't ever tell me to keep nobody's name out your mouth. <laughs> your man's is a and weird old freak Red, nigga what's with freckles that be following shorties around with cameras and touching on them. And he's super weird. Now, when you see me do something, well, shut the fuck up because I'm not Debo. I will hit you and keep going. Thank Let's you. take a look at what Debo had to say. Right, let's go. Hmm? They just did a show and almost had he almost had almost like fifteen hundred in there talking just talking about this. That's them. That's not me. I have different things to conquer. I'm a grown man. I don't got time for that. That's content coonery. Mm. Speaking about Cap, speaking about an issue that happened to him. That happened to him is now content coonery. Content coonery. What what created the content for us to talk about? <laughs> this is mercy, what mercy. What did I just say? Niggas do outrageous shit and then be mad when there's outrage. You look, I feel like this is set up. You see the boxing gloves in the back? It's corny. They've been there, but it's you should have took them down after what you just did. Them you boxing should've... gloves are from 19. Them, them shits is Sugar I... Ray Robinson boxing gloves. Them shits is old as shit. <laughs> Those are the gloves Dems gave the check nine. Yeah, <laughs> them are some fucking. Oh, man. Fucking Joe Lewis boxing no, gloves. I don't participate in that. Respectfully speaking, Debo. By the way, he was in the chat saying saying something tough because they answered him because he was in the chat. This is how corny your man is, Mercy. Oh your man is corny, bro. Right, let's go. I, 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 that's I what I mean. When it created, listen, I hold on, Debo. Hold on, hold on, because you can't listen. I love you. You know I love you to death, but I gotta be honest with you. You went and created the whole circus of it, though. Facts. You. You went and created the whole circus of it, feeling like you had to do what you felt is needed. And you know what being in this culture comes with. You a 20-year nigga around this motherfucker. You knew what that moment was going to create, bro. So to do it and try to move on, just like we had ours. So for, for them to accuse us of the shit that didn't happen. or how Cole, I was with God you until right it. there. I was Cola. right with you. I was riding with you, dog. I was God. with you. <laughs> Yo, sometimes me and Sly have the same yeah. brain. They got to stop doing that. Come on, the same exact We got to stop doing that. I was, gotta stop riding, yo. I was with you, I was dog. There. <laughs> her, 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 big dog, yeah, Cola. Just like I want to shoot them some bail. Yo, yo, look, yo, listen. Yo. I want to shoot them some bail and say <laughs> they're doing that for legal reasons. Publicly, That's they cool. can't claim care, that. But I, he was doing so good. He was doing good oh. too. He was frying. Them. I'm like, yo, yeah, y'all at the same time. I'm like, ah, like, like, no. Even when he said. When we had our shit, I thought he was just gonna be like, when we had our shit, we, we had, had to go to through it. Too. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you know the facts of it. <laughs> oh my All god! Right, come on, come on, get back. But it to go back. on and niggas still accuse us. You already knew where this shit was going, Debo. So for the say it to go away, and then also you to wait there in the seven days like Noah's Ark to actually do your interview while Captain did thirty. It looked like <laughs> you were <laughs> no, 
Yeah, I, th- I thought it was 40. Also go to MREC. Maybe it was seven days. I don't know. I don't know all of them. Collaborated too. That looks like a bigger platform with the numbers that could compete with a cap's number. Looked like you was on some shit. I ain't saying that's how I felt. I'm just giving you the optics of what's going on because this is what happened with the choices we y'all made and you made when we went there. All this shit happened. Well, thanks for the optics, but I gave you the context. See what I mean? Like, okay, I'm gonna let him go. The context is inside the optics. This is the content. Thanks for the optics, but I gave you the context. I gave you what it so, is. I'm not gonna say and lie to you about it, anything. There was also something that Debo said during this interview that I didn't like, where he said <laughs> the um, whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> well, I ain't like not a word of it. But go ahead. He said something about um because they talking about you know him handling the situation. He's like, oh, that was a personal matter. They bought handled publicly public. on camera. <laughs> yeah, you brought it to a public function and it was on camera for the world to see. So it's like, come on, Debo. <laughs> it's so corny. It's so corny. The deuce, um, it is uh, the way he talks is just it's creepy. That was, but that was, it, that was I guess, he got put his killer voice on. Stop, stop body. trying to sound all sophisticated now, my nigga. Dog, you did some shit in public, bro. Cause you were yeah. mad. Cause you apologized for something and took it back like a female. Does. I take my apology back, and then and then you and, and still was being a fifty year old teenager. Got to be exhausting. Yo, <laughs> Cole is basically I up. Uh, if we redact the whole when that part wasn't true. Yeah, yeah. We'll just take that out. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm telling you. you facts, nigga. You know what battle rap is. You know if some shit happened on camera, niggas are gonna talk about it. Mm-hmm. Niggas talk about way worse shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, when e yeah when Easy got duffed, mm-hmm. everybody Debo, you was talking about that shit too, mm-hmm. and that wasn't on camera. That wasn't on camera. Damn, every light you got is dun, dying. Yeah, oh man, light too. But you know what I'm saying? When Debo got. You know what I'm saying? Hold hold when, on, when, on. when when niggas go through certain oh, no, shit, this one is over. <laughs> when niggas go through certain shit, niggas be like, yo, it's public information. Yeah. Right. Nigga, I gave you the context. What was the context that niggas can't talk about? So you as niggas can't talk about what niggas see on camera. Exactly. It's just like an. It's any, not even. And a, the crazy part is. Go ahead. Them. Go ahead. Go ahead. It's not go even ahead. like this was footage niggas dug up. Nope. It was in the middle of a pay per view. Bangs is doing his interview, mm-hmm. and you see behind. Yeah. So niggas is watching an event and see you move on somebody. And push on a little piece of snow. Don't forget that. Yeah, you push down a little snow bunny. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> push the shorty to the ground. Try to duff a nigga. It wasn't yeah. like all of this footage came out after. Yeah, the outside parts came out after. But the initial part. Oh, he saw you. I think she uh, reached out to him or something. Good. And then he apologized. I hope she sues him. <laughs> Damn, she could. For, for could being tra- traumatized. I hope she could. I hope she has a uh, post. Uh, what's it called? PTSD. That's what I want. <laughs> Go soon for PTSD. You think every black person coming to you is gonna knock you on the ground? You got tra- post traumatic syndrome. Brizzy, listen, Brizzy. I feel you. I, sometimes you gotta die with the lie, my nigga. Sometimes you gotta. Die with the lie. <laughs> I can. I can name you three people on the BCM Discord watching them bootlegs. Myself, Cola, and Debo. Yeah, Debo was there wa- watching a bootleg. I mean, this is how corny he is for clout, right? He he, not only was in the Discord watching a legal uh, uh, racket. But then he jumps in on a space and says, yo, yo, these people, man, they don't even care. They just they just want to get you because you're doing good, man. They just doing good. What is it? What are you leaking without permission here? What is this? He won't put, he won't put that out. Oh, hey, I'm the girl that hit the floor last week to do at QB Black Diamonds event. A Ward reached out to me on your behalf to extend your apologies. Uh, I just wanted uh, to say uh, thank you for the hold on. Thank you for the kindness. You didn't have to apologize to nobody, and I just think it shows a lot of class. So another man told you. So he didn't apologize. He told another man to tell you an apology. I, I'm pretty he, sure he didn't know who it was. So he told uh, A Ward. Hey, hey, A Ward. If you see the little white girl, I pushed to the ground. Yeah, tell, tell her. Sorry. Take that off the screen, man. Get that off my fucking screen. <laughs> I don't. Oh my lord, man. What? Come this on, nigga man. made a third party apology. What the fuck is going on? 
Yeah, he man. apologized in third person. Bro. Oh. And, then he's, and then he JJ saluted JJ like he did something Shout good. Like Caitlyn. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out Caitlyn, man. She ain't deserve wow. none of that. That was wild. Yeah. Oh, yeah. man. Seriously, yo, if you see, yo, if you see a ward and then he went to a, that's kind of racist a little bit. Yeah. You might know that girl. So. You go to the white boy and <laughs> Yo, tell the white crazy. girl apologize. This shit, you might know that girl. Yeah, yeah, man. You style. might know, you know all white people know each other. But the that's 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 mercy, man, man. I don't know why he likes Debo so much, man. But I'm I'm proud that he actually said something to him. I'm I'm proud that he actually he stood up to him and was like, Debo, you're not gonna yeah. punk did, me in no did more. You stand and... up to him about selling your show. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> did you tell him about selling? Yeah, you tell that B I said sorry show. when you see it. <laughs> if you see it. <laughs> <That's OB. laughs> tell that bitch I said sorry. Tell that snow bunny I said my bad. Get out the, get out get, the way. Get, get out time. black events next time. Get out the way. Don't <laughs> be with the niggas. Don't be where the niggas is at. You heard so I, Don't be where the niggas is at. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Nah, listen, you, this, this is my thing, man. I, you're I, I, a guest I, I, anyway. <laughs> you're a guest in this culture any fucking way. So I'm gonna go tell the other guest. To tell the other <laughs> guests that I'm sorry for doing some nigga shit because you know it's nigga time. Like what? <laughs> nah, listen, I got a lot of respect for Debo as someone in this culture who's has a respected brand. Yeah. Uh so yeah. when he's like, yeah, he's That's just he, he yo, oh man. Big. Stop, we gotta stop we go. doing that. Stop Here we doing go. that. That was it. all good until Debo came and robbed the culture. That's what it was. That's the problem. Mercy. All right, all right, mercy, 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 mercy. Can I can I at least speak my piece before getting no, shut off? All right, go ahead, like, go oh, ahead. But then, I don't want to know. Like, yo, first of all, I, as, as as somebody who came in, let the him battle go. Rap when, and right. somebody who came in the battle rap when I did, right? Tom Queen Legend, so I'm, I'm taking Queen my head. Queen of the Ring already lit. Queen of the Ring already, you know, off the ground and is making noise. When I came in. Debo embraced me. You understand what I'm Pause. saying? Like he showed me. Ah, oh, here we oh, go. Hey, Look, yo. Hey, Debo did what? <laughs> he, he, he showed me a lot of respect. He came through trap events, hosted battles, and was always, <laughs> yo, salute to the trap, salute to Mercy, and salute to Peso. He always, yo, here we go with this he dumb. You? Oh, oh shit. my God. Whoa. Anyway, nah. <laughs> Bone <laughs> yo, man. Here we go, Harlem. What up, man? Yo, anyway, that's what you just said that? That's I knew he what? did something to you. I I'm glad you finally come. You know, you know what it is? No, Drake Bell. Big, Drake so Bell made it comfortable. Drake Bell know. made it comfortable for him to come <laughs> out, man. Go ahead, We're man. Tell me what that. Debo Fly. did to you, man. We not Sur- doing that. <laughs> Surviving <laughs> Debo. <laughs> Fly. You know how to we are not doing. Oh man, here we go. You know how victims always like make excuse for their abuser. Yeah, yeah I'm, we're here That's now. I yeah. Now. See, I knew so. I knew he touched you, man. Yo, adapt. So run with the take. Yo. You have permission to take this clip of Mercy admitting that Yo, he you brought. Do not have do not you admit. have permission to take this clip, man, what? and and Yo. and and formulate an opinion. Debo you know, your has man touched about to make a whole video off. The shit. Yo, I'm good. He's right, and He's I'm gonna. Right I will. I will back you up on this one, Adept, he man. He definitely. <laughs> Why don't let them do that? Debo did what? Go- <laughs> <laughs> Yo, something is really wrong with y'all, y'all, man. Why on the set? Yeah. Debo edition. Yeah. <laughs> Debo Yo, is crazy. Everyone's going to be talking about how he robbed him, and then he comes out the darkness. Debo touched me. <laughs> he Yo, embraced bro. me when I got into the culture, and then he brought me over to the house. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I show's over. No, 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 oh, no. Keep, keep, keep going. No, no. Here, 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 here. No, I got you, bro. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I got you, Mercy. It's, it's, it's. The floor is yours. Here you go, brother. <laughs> here we go. Anyway, here. As I was saying, um, good music. I like the music. Yeah, the music, man. Oh no, turn that music <laughs> off. Where is that coming from? I thought somebody speak your, my hey, game sir, on speak your truth, my guy. Your We're truth, here. Man. Talk what? about how Debo touched you and you didn't <laughs> like it. You're not gonna do this with music. Like, <laughs> Go Yo. ahead, man. Speak your truth. Tell us what he did to you. You know we gonna get flagged. You playing uh Be- Beethoven or whatever the hell. That's not Beethoven. It's Skyrim. 
<laughs> we're here. We're here for you, sir. I didn't know Debo. Yeah, with the light, it looks crazy too. It's okay. Y'all actually play Skyrim? No, it's just don't, the... don't switch it. Don't have to start. Your name is No Mercy. What happened? Go ahead. Tell me what Debo did to you, man. He showed you no mercy, my guy. I'm not that sure. He showed you no mercy. He showed you no mercy, and he groomed and embraced you. Tell us how. What happened? Go ahead. Get your bars off, King. What's your sponsor, man? Yo. I'm here for you. This video is about about Queen of the Ring. Give it up for the lady. Oh, man. You know? He said, I am strong because I said no. <laughs> Beg for mercy, battle with me. That nigga said, I am strong Yo. because I said no. That's why I can't that do a show with you, man. Yo, I am That's crying. Just why I my lifetime. I'm just saying, you said it. I'm only going to. That's why I can't do a show with y'all. He That's showed you no mercy. Fucking, hey. hey. Hey, Sly, oh, that segment man. was brought to you by the ID channel right there. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Surviving Debo. <laughs> Coming Debo, soon. All right, so no, for real, tell me how, what Debo did. He, or uh, uh, how you and Debo got <laughs> together. <laughs> yeah, tell me what he was doing. He was shouting you out. He was grooming you and what? Tell me. <laughs> See, here we go. <laughs> no, no, for See, real. The right. arms of an it's... angel is crazy. <laughs> But listen, me, 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 and Debo have have been able to build a, a dope rapport. Over embrace the, the trap, no mercy story. <laughs> oh my god, embrace the trap is crazy. Look, me and Debo been able to build a good, solid rapport over yeah. the years. Yeah, over the years. To the point where the the messages I showed you, like we have that level of honesty with each other. Yeah, you get what I'm saying. So when he do some bullshit, I have no problem. You know, correcting correcting them on it, and we still keep that respect for each other. Yeah, you know, but when he do some bullshit, we gonna call it out. Mm-hmm. That's just it. You feel what I'm saying? So, what I'm saying. you know, all, he, 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 he might be a little, uh, you know, of of course. Yo. I, I don't know why. I don't know why this particular situation, like looking at how it turned out, got him in such a a frenzy because it's like he was dog. Because he thought Three, it was gonna go back different. The nigga. Like it's is it was gonna go different. He thought he it was gonna be. He did. Yo, I oh snap! You smack caps now. You Somebody's in the Bronx like, right um, now getting back smack. Like, who cares? Huh? It's not a big deal. He made it a bigger deal when, uh, well, being caps made it a big deal. Obviously, when he was, yo, he, I'm can't and, nigga you got know, he got slapped and was looking for the fade. How is that making it a big deal? He's he doing what he should have been no, doing. But I'm saying the theatrics is what blew it up. What theatrics? He was situation. drunk, got smacked, looking for and the was mad, and then was mad about that. Yeah, but that became meme fodder for the battle rap community. And you yeah, know how okay, we but who like cares that. about all that? But he didn't do anything just, wrong. But I'm, I'm not saying he was wrong for that. I'm just That's saying it became a bigger situation based off that. He got it smacked. Was a, was but what I'm saying is, it, if you look at it from a very basic level, it's, it was just a really bad smack. Him. Look, <laughs> yeah, Devo's got like, him all twisted. Stockholm syndrome. He's victim because you're victim blaming. Yeah, you are. A man getting smacked and then. Because you said a man getting smacked and look, he's supposed to consciously keep in his mind after being three bottles of Hennessy deep and get <laughs> smacked. Yo, I can't react because the battle rap community. I didn't say you couldn't react. I never said that. You called it theatrics. What I said was all of the stuff on camera made it a bigger situation. You called it the It blew it up. Yeah, but your man. Okay. Well, what am Skip I supposed to call it then? Okay. And, if it's and back, theatrics, hold on. What is it? Hold on. And, and, and. Let's do this. Stop saying he had a respected brain. Yeah, stop doing that. Because that's it bad is. shit. That's it, bad it's not, shit. It's not Babs. Babs. We're not going to do that. It's not just Babs. It's Babs, Zeg, Debo. So we're not gonna say he had a respected more. brain when it's three people running the fucking brain. And he's probably the, the worst of the three. He was the one right, that tanked it. Brain. Did it, he was okay? Was he a part of a tank? He literally Who admitted on Har- like, Hold on, he right, admitted on Harlem you. Legends show. He's the reason it failed. I thought he was being sarcastic when he said that. I still think that it's because it's Mercy, trauma from him grooming you. Mercy, of, Here we Mercy. go. This is what I be talking about. Mercy, out of all man. three of them, okay. So all right, we're gonna do it like this. Out of all three of them, Queen of the Ring, who's the weakest link? You can't what say Debo. What are we basing you can't say on? Babs because Babs don't even interact with none of the only time you see Babs is on the stage. Right. Vague does with his shit. He be low, except for the Rex shit. He's pouring shots at Rex. Oh, yeah, that, that was weird, too. 
That's he indulged in wickedness one time. Who was always exactly? Indulging? He admitted who, it. Who always? No, I remember. In... I just thought he was being sarcastic it's, when he said, "Bro, no, he no. even he said, no, okay, no, I'll no, admit no, that, no, but no, admit no, that." No, he said, okay, I'll admit that, but you got to admit, and then that, and whatever he said after, it doesn't even matter. Right. I'll admit I'm that. Uh, I think I'm that was that. Who engages in the most wickedness? Uh, Debo. Exactly. If Debo but was your bitch. Saying, she, he, well, hold on, hold on, hold on, oh, so that makes it okay to rob the girls? That makes it okay? Was Vague was vague robbing the girls' money? Vague was robbing them? No. What about Babs? No. Okay, who was robbing them? Hold on, Babs hit up Snoop and told Snoop that Snorks. he had to pay. Um, no, she had to get a cut before Jazz the Rapper rap. Babs did that. He, he had to get what? Babs hit up Snoop Dogg and told him he told him, "Yo, Snoop, I need a cut before them girls rap on Gladiator School." No. Oh, okay, so so it was Debo doing hold on, that. Hold on, so if Deep right. was that robbing the girls or was that robbing Snoop though? That's robbing, robbing the girls. The girls. The girls. Hey, Snoop don't give a fuck about whatever little fucking five thousand he's about to spend on them girls. Now, is that Robin Snoop or the girls? What are you talking about? How hold on? How can it be robbery if the girl performs in a league he just paid for? Mercy, explain that. Make that make sense. Robbery would mean mean uh, Snoop paid him and no no girl shows up. That's robbery. Now tell me how when Snoop pays and then the girl shows up, wearing that is robbery. Explain. What you mean wearing that is robbery? Yeah, exactly. You have no answer. So now you got to repeat what I'm saying. That's Listen. not. Oh Who my lord, you, you just said ass. no. Hold because on, X. Hold on, X. Saying. He said that's is it robbing Snoop or is that robbing the girls? Well, if Snoop, Snoop is paying now, had the Debo because clearly had Debo had to get his cut because he's a scumbag. But D, if Snoop is paying Debo for a female to show up on his league and the female shows up, is that robbery or not? As how's that robbing Snoop? Nah, because that's that, what he's trying to get the money from. Oh my. Uh, what are you know, talking really about? Duty. What when are you, you talking about? Somebody, you're taking money from the person. But he's not he taking if he, he paid he Debo paid for them. a girl and the girl shows up. That's not robbery. robbery. Regardless if Snoop paid five and the girl got two, Snoop paid nine and the girl got one and Debo kept the The girl still showed up. That's not robbery. What are you so talking about? What's the robbery about? that we're talking about here? Debo taking hold on, hold on, cuts for money that Debo has nothing to do with him. Opportunity for them girls, cause Snoop said, "Here, Jazz, I'll pay you." Fucking, let's just start a number ten bands. Then Debo comes in and says, "Nah, we need 15. Cause he Debo wanted his cut off of fucking Jazz. That's robbery. That's He's Debo stealing the from them. But you're so tra you're traumatized by what he when he I'm embraced you. Oh, oh man! My God. Oh man! Book, you know up. how many league owners do that? Are we serious? I mean, all these okay, name them. Sam. Sam. Milltown right, Blow. That was public that he was doing that. In, in how many okay, so he's a right. He's a thief right too. Now. So who else? Hold on, hold on, hold on. That, that, but you're not a thief when you're doing that. We, 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 oh, oh, wait, wait. What do you mean we? When when you, when you say? Oh, so he Debo was managing them. He was. He was. He was. As Norbs did. Um, the jazz manager. Okay, so why didn't he need to cut off that? And because that was just Norm. have Norm was managing. fee already. Oh, we talked we're talking about, about Debo, bro. Management bruh. has a fee oh, already. Man. Management has a fee, bro. What are you talking about? When you sign a contract right. with a manager, it's already implied that you get 20% of the work before right. that. Before we do any business, right? Debo is taking money from girls he don't fucking manage. That's what's stealing. That's stealing. Not management fee. You don't manage these girls, nigga. So now we know you've been robbing these people too. Oh man, this nigga don't know what the fuck. Listen, okay, I'm gonna make it even more real for you. If you peso and Debo was doing the trap, and Debo was doing business in the trap, like he was doing business at Queen of the Ring, would peso still want to do business with him? Fuck no. Negative. No. no. Peso. <laughs> all right. Nah, pe pe I ain't gonna hold you. Peso done curved a couple of things that, yeah. That <laughs> what? That what? That what? That Who? what? <laughs> that Debo was a part of because he yeah. knew he was a scumbag. You know yeah, exactly. Like, you stop. Know why? Like, what? what? You look. was a stand up nigga. You know, I'm looking up. We're we're gonna take you to. We, you need therapy. Let me let me look up yeah, some places yeah, for you, man. We need to get you help, bro. Debo has corrupted you? your mind, man. 
He did some wild. I'm not gonna hold you. I need to look more into this um situation because uh oh now he's gotta look in this situation that happened twenty five thousand years ago. Oh now now I don't know anything about it actually now that I think about it. Yo, get out of here, bro. Yo, stop. (laughs) We gotta check on our man, yo. Yeah, 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 yeah. He did he he messed him up, bro. I I'm gonna look up that one girl that was crying because Debo ruined an opportunity for her. I'm gonna look up that girl's Uh, name. He's Amanda Bonds. Yeah. <laughs> oh my Mark God. Yeah, go. yeah. You know what? I, I forgot. I think she's from Milwaukee or something. I forgot her name. But Debo did something. She was crying on the phone because she was upset because she he ruined her. I'm going to look that girl up. Actually, I think I'm going to do an interview with her. Just to, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If it wasn't for Jazz. You want going, to go ahead. No, if, I'm going to. If gonna. it wasn't for Jazz going public with that shit. He like, would still be that's doing why it. the girl because Jazz and Official was supposed to battle on Gladiator School. Right. And they did it because Debo was skimming, trying to skim money. See, here's what I'm gonna say. And I'm and I'm I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> y'all ready we for better help. y'all ready for yo, better, yo, we need a yo, we need a sponsorship. One eight hundred better help. Yeah. If you've been <laughs> fucking groomed and you don't know <laughs> that you've been groomed, you have Stockholm syndrome, we can get you a therapist. Yeah. Now look, now look. This, this right, go I'm, ahead. Saying, I'm gonna let him go. I'm gonna let you. I'm, clean, I'm, I'm, go. I'm, 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 I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it a buck. Okay, In terms go ahead. Of that whole gladiator school situation at that time, I wasn't as tapped in with like the news, More gossip, etc. That at the time, keep going. So I'm not familiar with the entire story. I'm just keeping it a buck. I'm not familiar with the entire story of the whole uh, Debo Queen of the Ring. Um, this the gladiator school uh situation. So how, do I, 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 how do I know it? But I'm not such a new fan that only watched your boy. How do I know it then? Because it's somebody he likes. <laughs> no, I'm keep, I'm keeping it a buck. Well, that, no, because you say I don't know mind. nothing. So how would I know it if I'm just man? You watch Joe Budden Hollow, and it, you always bring that up. But I how do I seem was, to know a lot more than you I know about? Because there was a situation. I never looked into the specifics of it. At that time, I was. I just that, knew I was something just, happened. Look, <laughs> at that time, I was just recapping <laughs> battles. I wasn't talking about the the ins and outs and the. That's no excuse. That's I wasn't doing any of it. I wasn't online. You weren't online. You you found that out from nigga on Montana Ave. Then I guess. I don't know. No, I did the research and looked into it. I watched you all. I watched everything. That's what you have I, to do. And, That's and, how you again, learn. At the time, I was only blogging on the battles, not the shit around it. So I had no Please, now he's gonna, please. Now he's gonna, he's not, not please. Mercy, you talked about you. everything, man. That that time. Oh. Now, he don't it's even a, know what cognitive you, dissonance you, is. Look, you want to look up when no that idea. happened? You want to look up my blogs around that time? Nigga, this was... Public I wasn't news. You, yeah, you was only bro. blogging about the battles, but you seem how at that same time managed to do a fucking forty minute fucking interview with Charlie Cliff. He's talking about all the money Smack owed him. Stop. Yeah, because I was asked to do that, and I was paid to film that. Stop. What are you talking Stop. about? Just, just, just say I like Debo. I was paid to film he it. What are you me. Debo is Joker. I'm Harley <laughs> Quinn. I got no, Stockholm that, syndrome. I love <laughs> my. He called you Harley Quinn. I'm dying. You call him Quinn. Marco. Call him Quinn. <laughs> Harlem Quinn, Sly. Harlem, Harlem Quinn, Quinn look, that's you. Here's me saying, I don't like know that. something. Shit like that. Shit we like don't that. have shit Von like Clippington here like to, to like you know, uh, actually yeah, bring up Harlem, the files and that, what now, now we don't have Von Clippington. Dog, that shit was nat- that shit was headline battle rap news for Mad Long. I wasn't into headlines at the and time. Then, I was into the battle. And then, oh, black. Uh, listen, black. Wait. Uh, once we're done with this Debo, I got about twenty Thank minutes you, to smoke. For the link. Thank you, JT, for the link. Oh, yes, definitely. Child. Child. Thank you for uh, the link. I appreciate Bro, it. Appreciate y'all can link it. to that. Y'all can't link to the Debo uh, stealing story, huh? Because there was what? five people. That, there's so many people that say he stole. It's hard to find it. So it's hard to find. But, but oh, I'll find it. I, okay, so bro. how about this? How about Trust this? Me, how about this? No, 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 no. Perfect. Hold on, X. Don't say nothing. All right. All right. Next week, I will I'm have Quinn. I will have that story of that girl crying because Debo ruined her. And if that happens, you have to delete your channel. You want to put that up? <laughs> nope. No, no, no. Because it never happened. And we're lying. So I go ahead and I'm bet. No, no, no. Bro. Bet it. I'm not deleting. And if I, how about this? And if I'm wrong, I can't find it. I'll delete mine. All mine. Bet? No, I don't want you to delete. Why? It, Debo never robbed nobody. I'm lying. Yeah, so bet it. Bet it. I'm you you, for you just said, oh, you can't find it. Oh, you just trust did me, that. Bro. So bet you, it. You I didn't me trust, trust me. Trust me, bro. For the proof. No. Okay. I, I, I will. Pro- I will provide it next for next week. And if I don't, right, I'll well, delete all. No, 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 no. And if I if I prove it, you got to delete yours. Let's go. 
I'm not deleting nothing. Because you know it's true. <laughs> yeah, it's not it. true. I'm not going to delete Th- Then name. bet. If I'm lying, bet it. I didn't say, see, I didn't say you was lying. I said, where's the proof? I okay. need more information. Oh, you, you need more information. Right, okay, hold on. All right. right, hold All right. on. Yep, let's go. So now if I pull something up of uh, 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 Debo speaking about it, uh, or, uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. If Jazz speaking about it, I want you to actually burn your house down. So here we go. Yeah, I'm gonna, burn your whole building <laughs> down. I'm going to look it up right now. Hold on. This nigga just what? <laughs> Hold again, on, keep like going. I said, I'm not familiar. No, here, like I said, I don't know nothing. Uh, okay, so we're going to see Jazz say he stripped me of an opportunity. And okay, so that never happened. Uh, let's just look this up. And if this happens, we're about to see a fire erupt in his house. And I can't wait for that. I'll let you call. I'll let you say, like, yo, get them out of the house before you burn it down. I wouldn't but... have cared about the Queens Flip ARP story if I wasn't going to Queens Flip events already. Like what? I wasn't into the the drama around battle why rap at the time. Why the queen flip? Yeah, well, I ain't Yo, even talking about queen flip. Bro. This is a view. This is trauma talk. Like, yeah, man, no, it's a lot of trauma. Nigga went right to queen flipping ARP. What the fuck <clears throat> is that? Jesus, <clears throat> You're talking about your man being a thief and talking about how he has a respected brand that nobody he, he's not respected in. All right, and I'm asking for the story of him robbing people. Oh, so now you need an entire breakdown of everybody he robbed. You see how he adds that extra to it now? So now if I show one, he's like, oh, you got to show everybody. This is what I'm talking about, bro. That's going to be the whole show. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah, and then when it happens, you have to burn your whole entire house down. Burn something. (laughs) Burn your house down. Yeah. yeah. Matter of fact, matter of fact, when we bring up this footage, you can't eat bacon, egg, and cheese for a week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's That's good. That's good. Right there. All right. JT linked it up. Look at JT. He linked it up. All right. Play it while I search for uh, JT. Put it in the comment. Good. Click that, Mercy, because it never happened. Oh, and here's the girl speaking about. Okay, perfect. I can't wait. We're about to see a fire. Keep going. Keep going. Play that one that JT played. Let's go. Hold on. I got to go to my um, my YouTube. Let's go. Yes, JT, the, thank you, JT. Mercy, tight. That boy, tight. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo. I don't know about niggas stealing, even though they still work. You gonna click the link, or what are you waiting for here, Mercy? Surprise invitation? You afraid why, to why click we, it? Why are we talking about Dwayne? Wait, what? <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Remember you told me link. Remember you told me DNA 2 said that about Lex, right? And it was so valid. The, the, the one that JT posted, I did click it. Play it. Hold on. Remember that? Hold on. Let me put it in theater mode to cover up. Never mind. Nah, remember how Lex, remember how Lex, <laughs> when it was about <laughs> Lex, it was valid yeah. information, I'm remember? I was under the impression that Debo was not working with Queen of the Ring no more. I was under the impression that Debo was not working with Queen of the Ring no more. Based off like posts and stuff that I see. You know what I'm saying? Like I just stuff that you see on the internet, you know, I, I don't really care what nobody doing or what nobody got going on. When I Queen of the Ring? No, so that's what I'm saying. So when I thought that Debo didn't have nothing to do with it, because when I started seeing the flyers come out saying Babs Bunny presents, you know yeah. what I'm saying? I was like, oh okay, and that's then remember bad. there was the controversy. Yeah. So I only agreed to this because I thought she was the only person behind the queen of the ring. Oh. I only agreed to this because I thought she was the only person. Oh, yeah, this is Steve Bruce. Oh. I only agreed to this because I thought she was the only person behind the queen of the ring. Oh. Damn it, Scotty! As well. Like, Why is that all glitching, like, bro? Like, what is going on? I have no idea. Still, was still a factor in this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I wouldn't have agreed to this so deep- had I known that Debo had still, was still a factor in this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I wouldn't have agreed to this. So Debo had I known that Debo had still, was still a- All right, so what's the point? Watch the video. If it was fucking DME Detroit on head, you let that whole shit play. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I wouldn't have agreed to this. So Debo, he said basically, in a sense. You said what, baby? I said Debo kind of a piece of shit, in a sense. Answer the question! I mean... I'm not here to bash Debo, but Debo know how I feel about he's a, him. But Debo know how I feel about him. I done told Debo. He's a piece of shit. Basically, I don't already, I don't already 
said what I needed to say to these other so that's why when we did our face off, I found it so uh, that's why at first I was like kind of awkward in the face off initially anyway because I was just kind of like where this top not saying that he's wrong by calling me top five but you know what I'm saying like where does energy just come from yeah. you know what I'm saying wow. yo 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 Gwitty is fucking yo having Gwitty there is crazy Boy, sloppy what's the point of that though Quick, quick, queen in, queen in the, um, what'd you say? What was the point of that video? I don't, I couldn't hear it. It was all glitch. You got the Harlem uh, connection ruining it. I don't know what was happening, bro. Oh, she it said, was all... what, she didn't say anything. Okay, uh, that was what did she point. say? I couldn't. No, she said Debo is a piece of dirt. That's what she said, pretty much. Oh, I, I, I couldn't. I, she, I couldn't. She said she only got involved with the card because she thought Dio wasn't a part of it. That's all she all right, was saying. Play your clips, Rob. She got uh Okay. All right. All right. All right. Here we go. Before I play this clip, where's your me... lighter, Mercy, and your gas? Yeah, but before I play this clip of uh, Marasha speaking about how uh, she got a call from Snoop from Gladiator School, and uh, Debo stopped talking. Debo found out. And once Debo found out, he you stopped that. Why you gotta explain it? Because I gotta tell you who it is before we get. You gotta coerce me into believing. No, what shut up Debo, for a second. No, 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 no. It has you. nothing to do with what is being said. On, I'm sorry. telling you. Hold on. Coerced him. No, no. Yeah, no. It has nothing to do with that. It's about who <laughs> it's coming from. I don't want it to erupt. Is what it's I'm talking about. It's called. That's reporting. what I'm saying. Yeah, he's cutting me off because he don't want to hear it. So I'm just telling you the story so we don't we can get Think past who's telling talk. it. That's what Harlem I'm saying. This is because this is the one I could find off rip. That's why I wanted to show. I don't want the whole crop. The whole day they were fighting about unbiased and it has to do with him talking about it. That's why I was saying, let's just get past. It's just about what he was saying. Get off of who it is. That's what I was saying. Mercy, but he kept cutting me. Why did it stop? <laughs> Testing. One, two, one, two. You want to hear the girl talk about it? Yeah. yeah. You want to hear the girl? A little piece of yeah, the girl. Yeah, the person who's actually involved. Okay, all right. We'll hear the girl talk a little this, bit about this, it. This is Stockholm Syndrome. Right? Stockholm. Oh, no, I just well, jumped Because I'm asking for the person that actually involved. No, you know this nigga you know has it? done dirt in this fucking culture, and you just sit. Later. Debo, I never put that interview out, man. There's a lot of stuff to be going on with Quinn in the ring. I know people... So the girl was talking to Chris about what she went through. And she was stripped of an opportunity about gladiator school. Right. But you don't care about that either, that right? <laughs> you don't right. care about that girl well, yeah, either, right? What actually happened? You said she stripped of an opportunity. What was Snoop she Dogg hit her he up? Just oh. told Snoop you Dogg, what happened. Snoop Dogg hit this her up. This is the personally. only person that had talked to her on the internet. This is the yeah. only oh, person. Is, and she I thought she spoke had like a whole interview explaining Oh, it. oh man. No, listen, I had, listen. I had no idea. Chris just about said what happened. I, I she, can't. I, I got. I got to go, go man. I, I can't. I'm done with Bull, man. man. Yeah. yeah at this point, like we, there's. He likes him too much. Chris and there's no Chris way you can get. It. Yeah. Chris, I, Chris I, clearly no, said what happened. I want to. Nah, when bro. Like this happens, Chris clearly yeah. said what happened. Nah. Yeah, yeah. He likes clear explanations when it involves someone he likes. That's fine. That's cool. Go ahead. Go ahead. I say Lex is. So when I say Lex wasn't doing blackface, did you watch the whole thing to get a clear story? No, I didn't. I just I never I just seen went it live. I only seen a picture. What? what okay, so why do you want the clear story? When you didn't need the clear story there. Like, but when it's somebody she, you love, you want the fucking whole Bible. Why? Even this right here. Hold is on. More, hold no, he's not more, answering it. He's not. An, he's not. Answer my he's question. Answer why it. When it's from all the, these people. Listen. Answer my question. Why when it's somebody you don't like? You can take a snapshot of some bullshit and run with it. But when there's somebody you do like, I have to give you a whole dictionary worth of shit. X, you can't use that Lex shit. I only seen the picture. I don't know there was a live attached to that. So I, so me telling you, you that there's a live that. is I didn't a know whole... This back hold on, hold on. Back me forth. telling you that... Hold on. Me telling you that would be me giving you the whole story in context, right? Yes. Right? So I also why said I don't think he's racist. I said that publicly. Hold on, interview. hold on. You, you so didn't you want the whole for? because it's somebody you don't like, so you didn't need the whole context. Well, of why what the are you looking for? That. That's what Debo, you need the whole context. It's just like when DME Detroit found Cola fucking 
bootlegging, you shit it on DME Detroit. But if somebody you do like do some dumb shit like right now, you ride for them. <laughs> I'm just asking for a clear explanation. The whole chat is telling there. you to stop. It ain't just me. I'm not paying attention to the chat. I'm paying attention to y'all. Now it's fucking y'all my man. Y'all supposed to be putting me on, telling me exactly. So we're telling what you this nigga is a thief, bro. This nigga has stole this. Morasha just said Snoop Dogg personally hit me up, but because but Debo somehow took me off of a card that wasn't Queen of the Ring because he was skimming money from the rest of the girls on the fucking card. But how does her him skimming for everybody else get her kicked off the card? Because no, 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 no. He, that wasn't what Mar- Marasha. That was a different situation. She, Debo stopped it because Queen of the Ring was involved allegedly because Debo Deboed his way into it, and it's because she never battled on Queen of the Ring. He didn't want her battling on Gladiator School, so he stopped that from happening. Even though Gosh, Snoop wanted right, her. That, see, now that you explain it like that, it makes sense. I said now it in I the did. beginning, and you yeah. just. Didn't so want to hear it. You're on Debo. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Before we go, before we go, I got this one thing to say because this guy brought it up to me, and I do want to say this for if, well about those battle facts, real quick, real quick, real quick. I saw this man decide he wants to go on the campaign to get a death out of here, right? I saw him talk to I forgot, I think he was on the where oh, he was on Harlem Legend show, as a matter of fact. So oh, so yeah. he was on Harlem Le- Legend show talking about he wanted to get a dead body here, doing his little angel, doing his cornball, old timey speech where he's going to drag on a whole subject. Right. And they were talking about the whole snitch paperwork. Now, I don't know. All I'm saying is the, I heard his man, uh, the Cody, say that he told him he could put it all on him. OK. And then there's paperwork saying that he did take the t- uh, he did take the stand and kind of whatever. But then I'm like, but I don't know. I don't know exactly what happened. I have to look at it in myself. I don't trust people's words always. I'm just listening to what people are saying, right? Right. So then Battle Facts starts talking about how he had aided and abetting robbery too. And that means that he didn't, that means that uh, whatever he said, he's admitting fault, blah, 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 blah. So he had no choice but to say whatever he said. But that's not true because... I had that same charge and nobody else went down but me. It's just a lesser charge of robbery. So what he was saying and explaining about their aiding and abetting is not true. I got the same thing and I was the only one that went down. (laughs) I was just, I had a first and it went down to second aiding and abetting. So that whole thing he was talking about made me think, I'm like, Oh, nah, bro. I don't know. <laughs> now you now you're not making sense because <laughs> uh, you're talking to someone that had the same thing. So that Just part, but didn't stand does and not that, make you a snitch. I wish okay. people would stop. Um, and then and then no, because people take the stand to confess their innocence to upset. Like you could just be yeah, I want to te- like testifying it. does not make you automatically a rat. I, if it someone doesn't. if someone's <laughs> saying that I did something and, and then and I want to testify that I didn't do it, that doesn't make me a rat because I hit the stand. That's not what happened. But that, but when you hit the stand and you start saying, yeah, I didn't do it. They did it. Well, now you're a rat. <laughs> yeah. Now you're a rat. But, but coming from the dude that actually got locked up, the dude um jackpot, he himself said they agreed that, yo, put the situation on him. So yeah, but Battle Facts the- is saying he didn't do that, but he said that he told him already to put it on him. So that's where the that's where the confusion is. Wow. That's what I'm saying. So he's yeah. making it worse already. Yeah, that it was him type, that's rad. Now that's what Battle Facts, he's saying he did. I mean, he said specifically in Michigan what the penalties are. Uh, I don't know what that means, but he's, uh, but he was on there saying that he had, he had no idea. I mean, in the paperwork, it does say he thought he was going to do something and he didn't know it was happening or whatever. So yeah, all I know is the Chuck E. Cheese thing is weird. The always going at Ponce, but not saying what she did and then saying like insinuating over and over and over again that something happened, but not saying it. And then the most you could show is that he liked the post. At this point, you look corny and I don't like none of them. And you know that I know that I don't like I don't like DME. I don't like Deb. I don't like nothing. But them pushing you on this situation, they're 100 percent right. I got to give it to him. At this point, right. you're being corny. He did it again in that live, too. He was like, he was, that was making fun of the whole dog thing that he had, right? The dog, when he dressed his dog in a rubber ducky suit or something like that, that weirdo oh, nonsense. God. 
And he was, and then he insinuated it was Ponce that got him. He's like, oh, you know who got that from me? Oh, all right, you know who got that for me, right? You know who got that from me? Like insinuating it was Ponce. At this point, you're a cornball, bro. A big, I, I just, he's a cornball. Uh, oh my God! Debo shows up at that. Mercy's still fat. That—that's what he came up here for. Bull was robbing, <laughs> stealing, running around. Oh this is what he—this is what go. he did. The caps. He won't talk to him, but will show up in the chat saying something. I it, stop. We out. I, man, we're gone. I, but I, I want to finish this battle facts, and then we're getting up out of here. So, now, so Debo, I'll pull up next week. I don't. There's nothing to talk about. So he can sit there and mercy. do the dark. So he, he can he do the deep. My man. What? Oh my God! So, so, go. Yeah, he did groom you. That's wild. So, you. so, so we can he could do the Dark Vader voice on that, like he did with Black Compass. No, it's good. He ain't gonna say nothing to them. Why would he say anything to us? Because I'm because I'm here. Because he because he because his victims here. Get the fuck out of here. He don't know me, Mercy. Okay, well then uh, he, I'll tell him. All right, they come up next week then. Next Perfect. Week. Next, next week, week we'll Debo will be here and we're going to have a whole bunch we'll of conversations. Like you That's what Yeah, who's this dude? You're great. Awesome. He'll show up next week and we'll have that whole conversation. We'll talk about it. Yeah, oh. but he won't, but watch. So, so this is all I'm going to say. Debo or Debo, if you yeah. uh, if he says Stop grooming people. He said, you know, my guy. <laughs> no, here we go. Stop with that grooming shit. You said he groomed you. You said he embraced you. you. No, I said he embraced me when I first now came. Now you game. ain't. Get you know what I'm saying? And now, now. Oh, now he threatened. To... Now he's going at you, X. Now you have to see him in ten months. Now we <laughs> anyway, so, 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 so appreciate it. Job. Yeah, right. Next thing. week, That's let's see if Debo job. shows up. We'll have a whole thing. Battle facts. I mean, if you want to talk, I mean, we we you said you were supposed to pull up 19 years ago because yeah. you said I got something wrong. Yeah, so you can come on too. Oh no, I, 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 I never sent them the link. That was my fault. Yeah, this is the show when the shit goes down. Everybody come here and talk. Yeah. We gonna Anyways, be here next Saturday. Next Debo, week, we can pull up. We're gonna see. We can pull up. We can get it cracking. Debo yeah. pull up. You know what I'm saying? I'm yeah, Alex, on, keep your head on a swivel, bud. My head is on a swivel. I'm going to be on a swivel till next Saturday. You heard? Me and Debo going to jump up. Listen yeah, go ahead. Yeah, yeah, look, at, look, at he, look at how he is now. He feels comfortable as man's around. All right, so we yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, we out. See how the energy changed, Mercy? Ex ne next when your week. your pops up. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. Next week, we'll be here. Let's see Mercy if he shows up. We'll be back. Right. Appreciate y'all.